Hey guys, uh, welcome back for another stream with me, Supernotus. How are you today? I uh, hope you're having a good morning or, well, evening, depending on where you are, I suppose. Uh, but yeah, I hope you're having a good day, one way or the other. Uh, today we're going to go back, we're going to play a bit more of Tales of Monkey Island. Uh, last time out, we... Well, we managed to rescue Guybrush from being imprisoned. However, we do now need to uh, grow like a sponge grande, or, well, in fact, it was a small sponge. Uh, when we started, but we need to grow it. There's a th some bits and pieces we need to get to do that. We got the first couple, uh, but I believe we were on to the third, which was something like taste that hits you like a mallet. Uh, well, let's find out and let's play it. Here it is. We'll get rid of this music for now. Because we want to hear the game, don't we? I think we do. Uh, so let's get on with it. In just one sec. There we go. So yes, we want to load our game. In fact, resume our game. Should... No, apparently not. The last save... I just want to make sure... Yeah, that would be the one. That was the last save. Let's hope we haven't messed up in some way. Let's soon find out. I'll check what, uh, what stage we're at with the sponge. Yeah, no, so we got the two part, first two parts of La Esponja Grande. Uh, and now we want to speak to the uh, voodoo lady so we can ask her about the third option, which was... Uh, well, basically we've got this map. No, 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 that wasn't right. Yeah, that's great. Put the map away. There we go. So if we have a look at the map, it gives us a feast for the senses. That's that's what it's all about. And if I open this, we're going for this one. Before the main course, cleanse your palate with taste that hits you like a mallet. I'd better fold this up before I put it in my pocket. I, I'll probably be playing that... Um, on one of my in in the evening, probably tonight, I think. Uh, I'll be playing Call of Cthulhu. Because uh, I've been doing sort of a, a daytime option, where it's something a little bit different, and then um, my Again. evening, where I'm doing the kind of longer ones that I'm kind of working through. So yeah, I'm probably I think going to do that tonight. Uh, let's see about this feast for the about senses. This feast for the senses. Like I've got a few different games that I'm kind of <laughs> doing all at the same time, so maybe I should just kind of work my way through it a bit more. Um, do, 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 do. Was it, is it that one? Can you tell me about the palate cleanser? Before the main course, the palate must be scalded clean by a powerful powerful taste. Ooh, like grog. No, not at all like Grog. Nothing like Grog. Grog doesn't taste right. Nobody likes Grog. Pirates do. But, all right. but no. For now. Let's uh, try not to get executed. Try not to get executed before I cure Elaine. As you wish. Okay, so that's the palate cleanser. Uh, the only place I can think where we'll get anything, any kind of food would be in the, the pirate club, right? If he could ever walk across the right way. Here he goes. Now, let's see. Is there anything in here that might be a palate cleanser, do we think? Uh, there was something... Fugu Jalokia Challenge. This sounds like it's going to be something... Uh, Are you pirate something enough interesting. Fugu Jalokia Challenge? What is it? Ugu Jalokia. Oh yeah, there we go. That's a pretty powerful taste, right? If it's a, if it's a hot pepper or something, which I'm assuming it is, then that would probably be. I'm just trying to think what time. Do 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 do. It'll probably be about ten o'clock here, um, ish. That I'll be doing it. I don't know. So it depends how long you're going to be on. Um, but you can always watch it, watch it back afterwards if you want, and uh, join me when you can if you wanted to. Uh, I don't know. I mean, I'm probably gonna, 
I'll probably be on... That's my usual sort of time. What is it? I'm looking at about half past 12 here just now. So you're probably looking at about nine and a half hours or something. Um, I'll be on with that. This I'll probably only be on for sort of a little while. Um, Tell me about this Fugu Jolokia challenge. Ah, to get through a little bit of it. of peculiar culinary delights, are we? Um, yes? Then you surely have heard of the Fugu Jolokia, the hottest pepper in this world or the next. Oh, that Fugu Jolokia. All right, so yeah, I mean, you'd be looking at the Fugu pepper many years ago from a three-legged bandit named Ort, winning it from what? him when I was able to one a.m. or something. <laughs> on the pepper for ten in Would that be about right? Seconds. Let's say it's uh, eccentric. Since that time, twelve twenty-eight here, so I vowed to pass on the pepper to the well, ten o'clock would be more like two o'clock for you, would it? His tongue on the Fugu Jolokia for eleven seconds. It was quite late. <laughs> well, see how we go. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna, I am gonna play this for a little while. I might, um, I might do something else after that. Okay, so he's lifted the glass, so I can look at this pepper now in all its glory. What exactly do I need to do here? I think we'll take a walk outside for a minute. I don't think we're ready to do anything with this quite yet. Ouch. No, I mean, I, I suppose the other op the other option is I could maybe do it tomorrow if uh, and play something else tonight. Um, if that would be, you know, if you if you're if you are interested in watching, because I've got a few games to go through as I say, so. I hadn't, I hadn't completely planned what I was going to do tonight yet anyway. Uh, I don't know. I mean, let's go in here. I still hadn't completely decided what I was doing tonight anyway, so... What, the, what oh, happened to Morgan's body? She's gone. Yeah, no, that's fine, because, as I mean, as I say, I'm not, uh, I hadn't decided yet anyway, and I know I had some other things I was going to, I was thinking about doing too, so, yeah, I'll probably do it tomorrow. It doesn't really matter to me, you know, it's going to be done one day or the other. <laughs> All right, let's see. I think we can use this. Auto trepanation helmet. Yeah, that's probably what I'll do. Hmm. An auto trepanation helmet. I don't think this sounds like a good idea, does it? Let's see what these do. Ow. He's drilling holes in his head. Does he really want to do that? What? My tongue. Well, now he's, his tongue's gone weird. No, we don't want that. God. Did, God. Oh wait, yes we do. If his tongue's gone numb, that would be ideal. Ow. Right? Surely. What? My tongue. Yeah, that would be ideal. No, no, no. Out the exit. Not the not the door to the disturbing room. We need to hurry because I think his tongue will go... I don't think his tongue will stay numb forever. We need to rush. Eat this pepper. Before his tongue's not numb anymore. Can't go any faster than this, though. I was thinking of doing, I, I, I think I'll probably do like an Xbox or PlayStation stream tonight anyway, so. So that's good. Get inside. Quickly, quickly. Oh, he's still okay. His tongue's working for now. Yeah, no worries. I'll see you tomorrow. God, it, God. Okay, Pepper, prepare to meet your master. That didn't work. Okay, mental note. The Fugu Jolokia is hot to the touch, too. Hmm. Right, okay, that's why. So I need to numb my tongue again, but I also need something. Yeah, I'll see you, see you next time. 
To numb my tongue again. Oh, what the hell just happened there? I got electrocuted. Go and numb his tongue again, but then I also need to probably use the my hook hand, not my physical hand, to pick it up. Which is a bit silly. How does he hand it to people? So back inside, numb the tongue again, and keep going. Right, uh, back in the the old auto trepanation helmet. We need to mess around with our taste again. Right, do it. What is it? My tongue. Yeah, your tongue. It's numb. Hurry up. What in the world's going on here? Sometimes you can walk out the exit, sometimes you have to click on the exit to be able to walk out. It's a bit of a pain. The walking controls are not, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm using a controller to walk. If you had to use the mouse, I mean, well, look, if I had to use the mouse, I have to drag the pointer like that, and it's even worse. So yeah, controller's definitely the better way to go if you are wanting to, if you want to control uh, Guybrush in this game, I wouldn't suggest using the uh, the mouse to do it, just because it's awkward. We still got those things right. Go inside there. Now let's remember to pick up the pepper with our with our hook. Da, 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 da. Oh, I need to talk. Oh, I need to get him to lift the thing again. Captain Threepwood, what can I do you for? Yeah. What's that? You want to take the Fugle yeah, hurry up. the challenge? Why didn't you say so? Have at it, Captain. The question is, is that delay going to stop my tongue being numb now? Right. Hook. Pepper. There we go. There we go. He's managed to do it without... Well, I mean, he shouldn't really have done it that way, but, you know. I've conquered the Fugujalokia. Oh, is that the prize? Well, the good news is, that's what we need for the sponge. Oh, his, tongue, his tongue is starting to get a bit hot now. Probably got permanent glossal damage, but it was totally worth it to get my hook on that pepper. So it was. Right, so we can pop that onto the sponge. And that shall give us a, it's a red hot sponge. A red hot sponge. So now what was the next one? The next one there's like a brain. The main course will cause quite a flap to find the sixth sense. Sixth sense. Use your map. I better fold this up before I yeah, put it put in it, my Fold pocket. it up and stick it in your pocket. And now let's get out of here. Let's move to the next place. Keep on going. Ouch. Da, 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 da. So, let's have a quick chat to the lady in question. Hey, you, again. Hello, tree <laughs> Hello again. Uh, feast for the senses. Feast for the senses? What would you like to know? Uh, tell me about the sixth sense. It says here that course four, I see dead the main people. course, is the sixth sense. It doesn't even make sense. Ah, I mean, Bruce does. Willis, that's the problem. But where the other five senses are limited to the finite experiences of the present, the sixth sense satiates the appetite for the infinite possibility. Should I, I'm not allowed to, to use spoilers here, am I? Future? How do I feed something the future? You already I don't know. The answer to that question. What, the map? Yeah, I know. The map. All right. Enough about the Enough feast. About the feast. Bye. Right, so let's see what the situation is with this map then. 
to look at the... Mm. Why can't I... I want to look at it. The controller's not great for doing that kind of thing. It has to be said. Uh, let's see. here. I'm not sure that's it. Although it's interesting that there are those... Right. Let's try this again. See, I don't even know if I've done this right now. This is the problem. Uh, do, 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 do. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. Hmm. Well, now I wonder if that's got something to do with it. I've got three of these idols. The ones with the spinny, with the spinny bits. Let's try that. Let's try that. Let's see if that helps me at all. Let's see if it gets me to the right place. Those three idols look interesting on the map. So, what do we do here? We go in here. Da 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 da. In we go. We go into the jungle entrance. So, I think. Oh! What happened there? We had a weird little jump. Right, we've got a skeleton. Um, I think we want to go this way. Yeah. Keep going. To that one. And I think... Aha! Well, that's a purple-coloured idol, isn't it? See what else there is. There's a green one. And up here. And there's the red one. Okay. Let's have another look at the map. I've seen all this. Let's have a look at this now. Okay, so just think here. There's another idol there. Have oh, I done this right? I'm just thinking. Uh, oh no, there's a question mark there. Let me try that. Oh ho! That's done something. Otherwise, why would there be such a vibration? Oh, this is different. There's a chest here. There is a locked chest. And as we've worked out, our hook is a pretty good lockpick. A very good lockpick, in fact. Let's see. It's helped us to open a variety of things. The last time I tried to open this chest. Ow! Stupid hook. Oh, I think, yeah, well. Oh, we can't or what didn't you have? Oh well, yeah, I mean, it, it's worked on locks before. Oh ho! Tarot cards? That's it. Tarot cards? Well, yeah, but six cents, right? We want six cents for the thing. Oh uh oh, we've just been dragged down into something. I don't okay. know what. That's a pretty good trick. Scary. Well, let's give them to the sponge. I don't know if I can just drop them on top of each other. I probably should have tried that. The future will give Lia Sponja a sixth sense that'll help keep me from getting yeah, into situations maybe, like this. Maybe if we're lucky, maybe. Uh, if we're lucky. Uh, let me think here. Do do 
do, do. What was the, oh, I've done that again. And to look at it. <laughs> so what was the next one? Now engorged a small dessert, a touch so shocking it might hurt. Uh, oh yeah. I gotta this up before I put it in my pocket. Remember when we left the club? When we left the club, he, uh, he got a shock. He got a static shock or something, didn't he? I don't even think I need to ask the question about this, because I'm pretty sure that that's the answer. There was, there was the, there was like a static shock at the club. So we'll try it. Because I was like, oh, what's that? When it happened, I remember it happening. I'm being like, oh, there's a flash there. There was a flash there. So yeah, here somewhere, there's something causing a shock. So they decided to put the rug inside after it was clean. Put the rug inside? Oh, why wouldn't they? Hmm. Let's try something here. Yeah. Guess they decided to put the rug inside after it was clean. Yeah. Whoa. Now that's interesting. Static charged carpet. Oof. Yeah, we, we upped the static there. Whoa. And it Dang caused it. us a problem. Well, hey, what's this? And now the live sponger uh, so that was the has been hit with a big shock. And I think there's only one more course left now, isn't there? The final course was... Your meal finished, let out a cheer. Or burp belch so loud that all can hear. I better fold this up before I put it in my pocket. Okay. Let's go out of here then. Ouch. Small shock. All it's right, not not as bad. Sponja, not so grande. That's five senses down and one to go. Good. Now where can I find a really big sound for an after dinner belch? Well, that's a pretty big one. <laughs> Did the sponge not hear that? Well, there's only one thing on Flotsam Island that can make a noise like that. And there certainly is. It's one of those things. Yeah, this thing. The sun just messing around with it again. All the way to immortality. Uh oh, Elaine's there. She's found a chest, though. She's found a chest. I think she might be making a mistake there. Ah, she's trapped. She just, she just didn't think. You heard the lady to singe. Guybrush, get out of here! No, and find fight your own treasure. treasure. This one's more. Ah, pirate clan. Whatever mm. shall I do now? Oh, I know. The trap me as well. Oh, clam dip. He's not very sensible, is he? Like you. Old Guybrush. You know, once I cure you of the pox that's making you say all these mean things, you're gonna owe me a lot of smoochies. <laughs> Of course. You with his lips. There's not long left of, of this part, so this I'll probably um, jump across to the next part. So I think we're pretty close to the end of this, if I remember rightly. And if we are, then we have to jump across to the final chapter, The Rise of the Pirate God. Try, try to keep it down, he says. Well, let's find out. Can we pop it in there? Oh no. What's this? An airborne peripheral? Hey, give that back. Yeah, that's mine. <laughs> and that's mine. My moment of triumph with your tedious voodoo powderal. <laughs> I don't think so. Wait, what? Moment of triumph? <laughs> we, using my arpsychronaton, I have discovered the unique harmonic frequency that allows me to pulverize matter into a fine powder. What's she doing? Spread it across the seas. <laughs> oh no. Observe. Oh, he's going to scatter a lane across the seas. Why is why is, why is that there? My word! First of all, 
thanks. It's that some kind of he's turned it into like a wood chipper. Skin. Second, you're crazy if you think you're gonna get me in there. Okay. Well, oh, I doesn't want you in there. You? <laughs> Why would you want you in there? You've not got the the pox anymore. Yeah. So he has lots of pirates that he can use. He's got the same unique strain of the pox that you once had. The same one that was flowing through your amazing hand. The All right. The one that I've distilled into my amazing jus de vie. Lofty. Jus de vie. Unfortunately, a single hand can only provide enough of this ripwood strain to produce a few meager grams of my jus de vie. Even if I were okay. to burn your beloved to the burn, I would only gain a few piddling firkins of the juice. Give you some only a few. Firkins? No. If I want Some a piddling firkins. Sounds, uh, doesn't sound good. Whatever they are, I don't know. Firkins? Well, I don't think she likes that idea, to be honest. Yeah, I don't think she's going to enjoy that idea. Take a sword in your gut. Uh oh. But he's already used it. He's immortal. You have to cut his head off, remember? That's what that's what you do with the mortals. You have to take his head. Hmm. For the quickening! Sweet. Who wants to live forever anyway, right? Shiny. Shiny! That's quite right. Now, if I... Hey, Voo! Hey, Voo! <laughs> Stick that in your eye! There's pepper in your eye! Yeah, now he's surrounded by fireflies. Hey, the monkey. <laughs> the monkey. Well, that's technically his name, right? You'll never get yeah, past Elaine's sword. My wife's sword, you know. I once saw her hold off a horde of angry Rotarians with nothing more than a pen knife and a feather duster. <laughs> I can quite imagine it. I can quite imagine it and believe it. Soon she will tire, and her fox will be mine to spread. The trouble is, she, she can't kill him. She can't kill him. Oh, oh, oh. What's happening? It's they're all around his head. The moths. The moths. His head's being eaten. Or maybe his turban at least. What's he gonna do? The horror! The terror! Oh, off goes the hand! Off goes the hand! Oh, you're in the worst place! I don't think your immortality is going to work very well in here. I don't think immortality is going to be much use. <laughs> He's a load of immortal flakes scattered around the world. That was a little too much to ask. At least I've got the sponge back, though. Yeah, fire it in there. Although, how am I gonna... Stick it in the wind device. Now that there's no, uh... Oh, oh, oh! Yes! Well, that was a little antic for Mac. No, it wasn't. Well, it's gonna, it's gonna scatter everywhere now, isn't it? Oh, right, the wind. Yeah, the winds. The winds. Here it goes. Have we cured the pox? Oh. Is it going to work? Is it going to fix everyone? Hold on. It's working! <sighs> Guybrush? Elaine! She's okay! I, she seems I to be okay so. anyway. But how did I get here and why does my mouth taste like coleslaw? Because cause it does. It's a long story. I'll tell you all about it once we figure out how to get out of these stupid clams. I wonder what happened to LeChuck. Leave everything to me, my friend. Oh, LeChuck's okay. 
thank you for letting us out. How'd you get out of jail? Oh, the guard was more than happy to release me once I convinced him that it was the only way to win Elaine's hand in unholy matrimony. What? Wait, excuse me. Unholy what? Unholy this. Guybrush. He's turned evil again. Guybrush. He's turned it's evil again. <laughs> this name shouting is jolly good. I don't fun. think they're shouting names for fun. Is that you? I'm the Chuck. I washed my hands. Should have known never to trust him. With or without all that voodoo, you're still nothing but an evil sack of scum. Correction, my sweet. Ooh. I'm an evil sack of scum who's about to plunder the grandest treasure in all creation. What's but that? The sponge? Share my booty if you catch me drift. He needs to... What? Oh, come now, my He needs to get lost. You can't deny what we've shared these past few weeks. The chummy camaraderie, the kind words, the oh, no. stolen glances. Oh, no. I know you develop feelings for me. Join me as my demon bride and together we'll demon bride to the very heart of voodoo itself. Go to hell. Skybrush is dying though. Well, you can't say I didn't try. Yeah. Looks like we'll be doing this with all that voodoo. Looks like it, unfortunately. the favor gonna be <laughs> that be, be the stuff as he turn him back kick his two face but for me Guybrush is dying our hero in between my love aren't you dead yet I've got wedding oh no Luke he's back the demon pirate out of respect for the new it's gone. I feel I should point out that you wave your sword oh, like no. a fairy farmer. Oh no! How appropriate. You fight like a pox infected undead cow. Yeah. He most certainly does. To be continued in chapter five. Rise of the Pirate God. Why wait? Let's uh let's start that now, right? Let's just uh <laughs> let's just fix something first. I'll just uh while I organize that, we'll just put some music back on. And I'll just be a sec getting that started. You're probably going to hear the game finishing there, but <laughs> that's all right. Okay, let's get the last chapter started. Uh, I'll do that later, thanks. Right. Get the next chapter started. That's what we want. And make sure that it actually stays on the screen. I had a bit of an issue getting everything on the screen earlier. Uh, I need to do this as well. Every time I uh, launch one of these games, my internet security software says, Oh, this game's trying to change something. It's like, yeah, I know, I just did it. I just launched it. It's just trying to play the game. Right, that should be okay now. I'm probably hearing the audio from it. So what I need to do is just fix my... Oh, that's a good point. Come on. Sorry, we're getting there. It's okay. Eventually, right. Jump back, I just need to... There we go. That's it. Rise of the Pirate God. Monkey Island Chapter 5. Well, let's get on with it. Without further ado. Rise of the Pirate God. And I guess Guybrush is dead. He's dead. What happens now? Oh, I need to put this music off too. we don't need that. What's happening here? We had the voodoo lady telling us about everything before. Yeah. That was what happened when we managed to escape from prison. We've lifted the pox though. 
unfortunately, as we just saw. They were killed. Or at least seriously hurt. No, we were definitely killed, I think. All the themes here tell me we were killed. Guybrush Threepwood, mighty pirate, but they've spelt it wrong. Is that because he was covered in mites, do you think? Get away from here, you dog. Hello? Dark in here. Anyone? Where am I? Yeah, come on, get out. Get out of the hole. Dirt coming from. Maybe I'll just take some to get it out of just the way. Just take some dirt to get it out of the way. I think I can see some light. And again. Let me just grab some more of this dirt. Hey. Oh, we're a ghost. I can't believe it. I've been buried alive. No, you haven't. Again. Try again. Hey, my hand is back. Uh oh. Well, this really can't be good. No. He suddenly realized, Where wait, am I? I lost my hand. Oh, there's a dock. There's a ferry. There's a grog machine. The real thing, probably. Let's see. Let's talk to this ferryman, see what he's all about. Hi there. I'm Guybrush Threepwood, mighty pirate. And mighty pirate, I yeah. I think I may be dead. Aye. 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 You're Shout dead. Aye. Aye. This boat looks immaculate. You'd never suspect it hauls What do you think he's going to say to this? Cleanliness is next. To oh, he actually said something else. He's got a gold tooth, look. Oh, do you go there too? That's it, probably not. Have we met Have before? We met before? Nay. Look familiar. Look familiar. Yeah. Are you sure it does, doesn't he? Aye. Aye. Can you take me back to the land of the living? Take me back to the land of the living? Nay. No. Not back to the land of the living. Uh, Where'd you go in the where boat? Where are you going in this boat? To the crossroads. Went down to the crossroads. Can we go to the crossroads now? Pay me. Pay you what? How much does it cost? How much does it cost? The golden eyes of everlasting sleep. Two coins. Eyes everlasting sleep. I have to give you my eyes? No. Nay. I mean, I know that I'm dead, but I'm. He doesn't still catch on very easily, does old Guybrush. You do not. Can I still see without them? I'm still really new to this whole being dead thing. It's dead. a metaphor, you philistine. Just give me the two gold coins that were placed on your eyes when you were buried. I don't think I had oh, two gold coins. Of everlasting sleep. Did I, I have coins? A pirate. But Pirates. Wait, I wasn't buried with any coins. No. <laughs> Typical. Pirate. Typical pirate. No, no coins. coins. No crossroads. Oh no, we failed. Why is there a grog machine in the afterlife. Probably so what we can get two golden coins, right? Waiting. Hmm. Fair enough. <laughs> There's a grog machine so we can get the so we can points. get the coins. Aye. Aye. Well, okay. Can I not pinch it from his tip jar, no? Oh, do you know what? I just thought of something. He likes to keep his boat clean, doesn't he? Let's chuck some dirt at his boat. I think he missed a spot. Yeah. Hey. You did. There's a big smudge of filth right there. You did. What? Oh, pig knuckles. I just polished that too. Rotten kids. Rotten kids. Steal from the tip jar while you can. He's got plenty of money in there. I'll just take a little. We stole his tips. What did we get out of the tip jar? A whole eight. We need pieces of eight, surely. We need some pieces. Uh, okay, so we should be able to use this on the grog machine, right? We'll probably have to put the coin, in, the note in and out a few Great. times. Now, what am I thirsty for? Does it matter? Just uh, uh, let me see. I'm not thirsty for anything. Hey, it may change for me. Just want to change. So what we should have? Two golden pieces of eight. So that's good, right? We got some pieces of eight. Although if it was a note of eight, how did we get more than one piece of eight? Who knows? Let's go and visit the old ferryman. And we can cross the river. 
to our eventual demise. Well, we're already dead, but you know. Let's cross over and see what's happening. Here you are. Two gold coins. Please take me to the crossroads. Yeah. I... Off we go to the crossroads. The single file. While the boat is in motion, you There's only one of us. The There's only me. Times. The ferry to the center of the crossroads is not responsible for any belongings left on the boat after departure. Fair enough. I understand. I think I get it. Does it do like a tour guide voice or anything? Uh. On your left, you will see a wall. And on your right, you will see a wall. In between, emptiness. Please keep all belongings in the boat. The... Death Ferryman cannot be held responsible for any lost belongings. Is that the place? Is that the crossroads? I went down to the crossroads. And it's just a little room. Oh, a new arrival! Oh. Hey! Sorry about that, but without the Take pictures. of enlightenment, old Caleb can't get a good exposure. Come, buy a souvenir picture. Buy a souvenir picture? No, that looks horrendous. It's not a great photo, is it? Indeed, you are just a scrap broke. of life or something. Yeah. Leave me alone. When you do get your hands on some cash, which will probably be pretty soon on account of your being a pirate and all, don't forget to come back oh, and so I also need to purchase a, a photo photograph. Of your very own spirit entering the crossroads. Yeah, That's I'd rather fine. not. Just stay out of my pockets, will you? Stay out of my pockets. Rise of the Pirate God! Do, 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 do. Etc. Well, let's go, let's go and chat to this guy. I didn't get a chance to fully, to fully chat to him. Excuse me? I have a few questions for you. Yeah, I don't want to buy the don't photograph. Mind, very uh, where am I? Where am I? That's a good question to start with, isn't it? Anyway. It's always a good question to start with. Where the physical and spiritual realms meet, and where your journey into the afterlife begins. Ooh. From here, you can choose your final fate and fulfill your pirate destiny in Fiddler's Green. Fiddler's Green? Or maybe you'll just mope about like a schlub. Personally, you look a bit like a moper to me. No, he's, uh, he's got a bit more. Uh, he likes to solve problems, so no. I don't think he's going to be moping. Trying to find my way, but I can't seem to find my guide dog. I've no? been here a long time, so if you get lost and need some guidance, you come see me. He seems to have lost his nose as well. Does he know the voodoo lady? Can She's alive. Lady? Can you be a bit more specific? Maybe a name? I'm not a lot of voodoo I don't have a name for time. her, really. I, uh, she never, never told me her name. name. I noticed I have a shred of life I in my pocket. What's that all about? What's that pocket? all about anyway? Why? Everyone shows up with something that they cling to. You must have thought that staying alive was pretty important uh, for some uh, reason. Uh, well, yeah, maybe somebody's uh, given him, you know, dogs. CPR. I, love cold dogs. I thought he said something else there. I didn't think he said corn dog. Because I wasn't Easily looking at the subtitle. Souls to the crossroads where they can choose, their eternal can choose my eternal destination. Once he's done his job, he'll no longer appear to you. That seems a bit odd. Oh, you can also choose. Where do you want to go? How about shower. not here? I can't stay here. Has anyone ever returned? Has anyone ever been able to return to the land of the living? Nope, never. No, sir. Can't be done. Mm. Are you sure no one has ever been able to return to the land of the living? Well... Whoever told you as long as it doesn't turn around, that. right? Of course it can be done. Why, I remember a handsome young pirate who returned to the land of the... It's Orpheus. Hoping to reunite with his one true love. I oh, know, that's the other Where way around. LeChuck, I think his name was. LeChuck? LeChuck? But he came back to life as, in order... <laughs> a ghost, a, ghost a, zombie, a zombie, a demon. A demon, a living statue, and a killer walrus. A killer walrus. I don't want to be any yeah. of those. Don't think that true love thing worked out too well. No, it really didn't. Either. Things started getting awfully crowded around <laughs> here after he returned to the living. Yeah, he, uh, uh yeah. Escape. He just grabbed himself aboard, caught a gnarly wave, and was out of here. But you'll have to return as probably a zombie pirate guy brush. That he surfed his way out. Yeah. What? 
No, that'd be stupid. Chuck, we can't. Oh, we didn't surface right. With a powerful voodoo spell that he obtained from the other side. The other side. Oh, yep. And if there's one the, thing the real I side. About, it spells. Was what it the, the voodoo lady that the did it, do you think? Was she, was she the one that gave him the, the spell? In a vile treasure chest. And hidden somewhere in the a vile treasure chest. But no one knows for sure. Well, yeah, that would take a bit of time to find, wouldn't it? strange old man who kind of smells like olives, but I don't plan on sticking around here in the afterlife. My wife is still alive out there somewhere. She's still alive. You do that. Might be surprised at what you find when you get there, though. Might be. I died like two minutes ago. Well, yeah, but what's two minutes? Huh? What's two minutes? Okay, well, what else can we do here? Take a look at the crossroads. There's a circle here. Presumably, this this is where we decide where we're going. Yes, this is the point at which every soul I must choose my path. The ultimate pirate path. You may choose sword mastery, thievery, sword mastery, or treasure thievery, or treasure hunter. E. E. How piratey? Oh. Okay. Well, in that case, I think let's try. Oh, he's gone. He left his boat here, though. I think we've got to try everything, don't we? What have we got here? Treasure hunt, thieves' den, sword fight. He's good at sword fighting. Right, he, he beat a lot of people. In sword fights, the old sword master, remember? Surely he's the best person to do this. Uh, let's probably have to climb the mast. It's a pirate after all. Climbing masts, nice and easy. Is this going to be where we end up having to rescue other people? Or something? Probably possibly. Oh, it's Morgan. Morgan? Ahoy, matey. I see another swordsman be coming to challenge me for entrance. It's pretty difficult to full of defeat someone when he's. He's got a sword through his head. Very well. Let's test your wit. Test my wit. Thank goodness, you're all right. Hey. I be talking to you. Yeah, well, I'm not talking no, to you. I'm not all right. I'm dead. Apparently, you are too. Now go away. Go away. I'm happy to know that I obliterated your murderer. Yeah. You destroyed Lechuk. Uh, what? Death must have scrambled your noggin. Lechuk killed, killed her, me. didn't he? Desinge killed you. Ah, uh, hello. Uh, not interested in him. Challenge over here. Desinge. But you said. That's just great. My one shot at redeeming myself, and Mr. Mighty Pirate can't be bothered to properly listen to my death rattles. <laughs> but and on top of that, he sullies my reputation as a kick butt pirate hunter by insinuating well, that I could you were in Desange's house. Wig wearing sissy boy like Desange with two arms tied behind my back. Yeah. I'm sorry. Pretty much. Oh, I'm depressed. <laughs> Look, I'm not planning on sticking around this land of the creepy. I got yeah. unfinished business with Lechuk I got and to find out how to get out of here like Lechuk did. I'm probably going to need some help getting out of here, and you are my only friend. Yeah. Forget it. I'm a worthless, backstabbing traitor with poor communication skills. <laughs> I don't even deserve to be your friend. I'm surprised she chose to are. be a sword All fighter. to get a little fight back in you. Come on, grab your sword and fight me. No, yeah. I won't fight an unarmed man. Well, I get a sword. Fight me, sword. Fight me. Well, I'm not done with you yet, lady. I'll be back. <laughs> yeah. Fine. I'll just wait over here then. <laughs> He's got way over here. Who made him the guardian anyway? Pardon me, mind if I borrow this? Hey, huh. The Chuck stuck that in me for a reason, you know. Did he? Le the Chuck stuck that in I, you. He came back after me and me mate stole some gold turtle from him. He chopped off me head and asked me to hold that for him. Nice. In your decapitated hold the sword for me in your head. Yeah. Oh, he just wanted to kill me, huh? Probably. That'd be my guess. Yeah, I would have right, thought that so. Makes sense. I would have thought so. Right, so we should be able to get her to fight now, because I've got a sword. I'm no longer unarmed. On your feet, Mo. Fine. Here we go. Yes. Now we're talking. I'm getting in on this action. No, it's not. Th Smaller men quiver at my unmistakably three-way fight. And it's not fair. You've got a head over there. I wave this sword around. It's like I'm a little boy. She's a what? She's a little boy. Uh, let me think here. What am I doing here? You're not a little Trust boy. You are no little boy. That's yeah. the best you've got. 
That'd be a poor insult. What? No, I thought I was talking to Yeah, the we have an insult. I, even that would have been a better comeback. But it's too late now. I win! What? But if he's the winner, then I must be the no, winner. No, 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 no. Uh, no, that's not right. What? So I had to insult her at the same time. Fine. We'll do it again. Ungar. Fine. Yes. Try again. I so I've got to insult her. Let's think. I used died to of dream failure. Somebody would call me the greatest pirate hunter in the world. You make me want to puke. Huh. Let me see. I bet people say that about you all the time. People say that about you all the time. Yeah. <laughs> My career as I beat a them. pirate hunter was about as successful as my career as a marathon runner. Nobody's ever drawn blood from me, and nobody ever. Well, I'm getting two different insults here. So what have I got to somehow? Well, you run that, you run fast? that fast. Surely. You're both going off the boat. I'm useless. I can barely even lift my sword. Barely even lift my sword. A foul smell coming from this fight. Mm. See, in some ways you are. Uh, yeah. Yeah, in some ways you are stronger than me. In some ways you are stronger than me. <laughs> you know what? You're right. I oh, here she is. She's she's hunter. she's got her confidence sure, back. I made a couple of bad decisions and my enunciations could apparently use some work, but as long as we are both here in the crossroads, I can still make it up to you. Yeah. You can't sure. touch my witty repartee. I could if you would use some breast spray. Yes. Wow. That's what we're talking I didn't about. Think that you had it in your last. Now my head and I can move on, and you can be the guy. Yeah, it's all happened. You just have to stay here until someone you have to comes. Stay here and forever. Yeah, forever. That's not gonna happen. Well, you deal with that on your time. <laughs> I'm off to battle on the end. He's trying to reattach his head. You know what? I think I will stay here and challenge the weak and unworthy for oh, a while. Oh, she's changed her mind in like seconds. Listen. I am sorry. Well, let's try some of the other crossroads if areas. There's any way I can help you? Just ask. Well, I'll think about that and come back to you. I will think about that and come right back to you. Good luck with the sword fighting gig. I'll be back. Maybe we can all join up together and get rid of the pirate. I don't know. Get rid of LeChuck somehow. Track down his ghostly remains in the vile chest that they were talking about. It's vile. Totally vile. Uh, okay, so what we're going to try next? Uh, well, it was the sword fight. We did that. That's the crossroads. That's the gateway. Treasure hunt. Treasure. All you can dig. There's a lot of crosses on the ground. Mm. Let's have a chat with this guy. Oh, it's a treasure hunter's dream in here. Yeah, so it is. I'm the boat making that noise. If there was ever a treasure in life you were meant to have, just do some digging and she'll be yours. <laughs> okay. Sounds fair. Let's have a chat with him. See what he's got to say. Tell us. He's got a massive hole blown through his chest. Greetings, fellow dead guy. I'm Guyver Streepwood. Uh, I know who you are. You know who I am. Wow. I knew I was getting pretty famous, but I don't think it's because legend. you're famous. Into the afterlife. Legend Schmidgen. We bumped into each other back on Spin <laughs> Isle. Yeah. Oh yeah, you were one of the guys trying to beat up LeChuck. How'd that work out for you? He's got a cannonball you hole in his chest. Smart guy. Ooh. I mean, I'm only guessing, but I don't I don't think it turned out very well. I've been told by a marginally reliable source that LeChuck <laughs> marginally reliable. Around here. LeChuck? Gah! He should bury himself if he knows what's good for bury him. Bury himself? You don't know anything about it? No, but there are a lot of X's here. Hard to tell what's buried where. Could be all sorts of stuff buried here. Yeah. There are a lot, there are of, X's. A lot of X's around here. Well now, aren't we the observant <laughs> spirit? Yeah, yeah. I, I, I thought I was being quite observant. Yeah. What's the problem? What's the problem? The of youth after I was being observant, away. wasn't I? I'm a... Just check something, sorry. We're all Sorry, I just had to check something. Down here, schmuck. And this is the this treasure, is the treasure hunter's, hunter's paradise. Of pirate booty oh, good. Under each and every X, as far as the eye can see. That's great, but it's not really what I'm looking ah. for. Why aren't you digging up more? 
Why aren't you digging up more yeah. treasure? Has he given up? Has he dug up enough treasure now? I have so far. Yeah, I mean, you can't, you can't make any use out of it, but yeah, it's great. Can you show me how the treasure hunt works? Yeah, you sure, dig a hole, right? Not? A pirate can never have too much treasure. Go to a hole, dig it up, profit, right? So he's just getting money. Oh, hello, can I have that? It's surprisingly light. I'll just stick that in my pocket. Maybe we can dig a... Can we dig a hole? This looks as good a spot as any. Yeah, dig a hole. <laughs> what are we going to get out of this? What will we get from the hole? Oh no. No, it's those pirate parrots. But there's loads of them now. So this is what happened to my cursed pirate parrot of yeah, It got broken into period. little bits. That's not so good. I wonder... Though, what about over here? There's a sign. Can I do anything with a sign? Hey, where are you going? Come back! Come back, you guys. Come back. Murray? Hmm. <laughs> it's not Murray, thankfully. Not scared of Murray. Murray's you are scared of Murray. You hear that, Murray? You're a punk. <laughs> <laughs> You're still a punk. Still not Murray. <laughs> Still not Murray. Splice the main brace. Another oh, another bag, bag of gold. gold. Well, there's a surprise. Never get tired of this. He just keeps digging up gold. I don't know why he's so excited about it either, because it's not like he can do anything with it. Let's take a look around. So we've done these two places. I mean, it's great. He's won all this. He's found all this gold. That he can't do anything with. Worth it. Uh, let's have the trip the tip jar. The guy's not there anymore. Hey, old creepy bones left his tip jar. I'll just take all the tips, well, I'll just right? Hold on to it. For safekeeping. What's he getting tips for anyway? I don't I don't suppose you can get anything out of it. Is there anything else here? Oh, there was that little dog. There was that dog. Where was he again? He was up here, wasn't he, on the hillside? Can I go up there? No. There he is, look. There's the dog. Give the dog a bone. If you excuse the expression. You look like uh, Franklin. Apparently his name's now Franklin. Franklin. Want a bone? Here you go, boy. Of course he does. Oh, poor thing. You should probably come with me. Yeah, just stick him in your pocket. Why not? Just stuck a dog in his pocket. You know, at this stage, it shouldn't really be that surprising the kind of stuff that he can fit in his pocket, should it? Especially now that he's a ghost. He's got some sort of pocket of. a magical pocket of shrinking. Right, let's go. well, to this place. It's the last place we had, right? The Thieves' Den! Although, if we go to a thief's den, Welcome, fellow thief. they might, uh... You are a thief, aren't you? Yeah, 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 of, of course. course you, are. you wouldn't be here if you weren't. Absolutely. Right. Of course I'm a thief. Excellent. Make yourself at home. Feel free to look around. We have many valuable... He's got no hands, Luke. Here. How come he didn't get his hands I back? Keep them around I got my hand back. How come he doesn't get his hands back? Did he have them chopped off again after he died? What's What's the deal there? Is there anything I can do? Pile of autographed hey, sextants. Nice. I had a collection of autographed sextants too. Do you have a Vasco de Lama? Ah, <laughs> I'm sure that I do. He probably has everything because he wow, probably stole them from me. Yeah, coincidence. That's hey, what I'd call what's it in too. This thing? That? Oh, that's a secret. It's a secret. Oh, what kind of secret? If I knew that, it wouldn't <laughs> be. <a> <laughs> wouldn't be much of a secret. Uh, let's see what else is around us. Just gonna take a look around your little cavern of stuff. Oh hello. What's this? What's the deal with this thing? Ah, that's an old one. Friend. It's an old one. They say that toe juice encrusted it's sock, sock. Was once worn by LeChuck himself. The thief who stole it claimed hmm. he slipped it right off the zombie pirates oozing undead foot without being noticed. Funny how he showed up here in the afternoon. Yeah, still crazy that. Sock in his fist. Wow. You mind if I uh, steal it? Actually, I'd prefer you just take that one. 
It's really starting to smell. I can have it. <laughs> you, just, you can just have it. Just take it. It's fine. Just take it. No problem. Excuse me. What is it, friend? Hmm. Happened to your hands? What happened to your hands? Yeah, I got mine back. What junk happened to them? I guess he still held a grudge from when we stole the summoning turtle from. Oh, was he there too? He came back and slaughtered us all. <laughs> Doesn't have no hands kind of cause some problems Doesn't there? No hands get in the way he's dead. I'd, I'd imagine. Not if you're good. I'd imagine I his death kind of gets in the way of his thievery a little bit, right? With my toes, Surely. <laughs> loot an entire treasure hold using just my. Uh, Cheeks. Ew. I shouldn't have asked that question, really, should I? Uh, what are all these what things? Are all these things? The things he's stolen. Those are the things I have stolen from the poor, unsuspecting pirates passing through. Some real gems there, huh? Oh, oh, yeah. I'm sorry. What was that you said? What was that you said? Um, I didn't say anything. <laughs> are you sure? I thought you might have said there was something behind me. Um, There's a three-headed monkey. Yeah. There is. Well. I'd better turn around what? and look at it. Why, I don't see Yoink. anything over here. I hate to be a bad Oh, host, what's he doing? I'm afraid you have got to be moving on. Well, it's time for me to leave, is oh. it? Okay, then. I can't have this place oh. full of thieves all the time, or people will stop coming in. <laughs> I can't have the place full of thieves all the time. It's a thieves' well, thank hideout. thank you for being so accommodating. Yeah. Speak nothing of it, friend. Feel free to come back at a later time. Come back at a later time. Is that going to become important to me? Uh, let's go back here. I just want to check my inventory. So we picked up a pot. Hey, wait a minute. Well, we might have, but gone. it's gone now. That two -bit thief robbed me. Yeah, well, he didn't take Pretty anything too. important, I don't think. He didn't take the money. <laughs> so, you know, I suppose there's that. I wonder. So we thought that there was... We thought that there was something hidden here of LeChuck's. The best way to find that out might be go, to boy. send the dog... To go the and look for it. I guess. Let's try it. If I take the dog now... Let's see okay, what he finds out. Dig me up a vile looking treasure chest. See if he see if he does anything. Let's what's he doing? Where's he going? Hey, he's off. Where you going? Bad dead dog. He's gone. Where's he where's he going? I need to go back to him. He's gone swimming. Where might he go? Oh, there's already one little check item in the thieves place, so it's probably not there, right? It's the only other place it could really be. Well, let's go back to the center, maybe. There he is! Franklin, there you are! You're supposed to be finding LeChuck's hidden treasure for me. What are you doing here? Oh, such a cute little dog! Uh, is he mine? Is he yours? No. Uh, no. Not mine. What are you hiding, Caleb? More than meets the eye. Of course, so more than meets nothing. the eye. Here, I'll talk. What? Why, I never! <laughs> But you do have the treasure. Yeah, let's have the treasure. You, you'll say no, and around we'll go. It's hard to say. Uh huh. Hello. What's on your mind, Deepwood? Mm. Oh, I know. Let's you buy the spirit photo of him. You got any money yet? Yeah. I do. Okay, well I'll have to go out of that. Talk to you later. Sure. Why not? If I give him the money now. I'd like to buy that spirit. Then he'll give me the photo. And then maybe he'll be a little more accommodating. To 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 yeah, well, that's not going to happen, is it? That should cover it, he says. Oh, you've got all this money. No, that's enough. Oh. No, he's left me some more. I wonder. Let's just... Have a whiff of this thing. Have a whiff of this sock. It's not my name. <laughs> that smells like him. Okay. The Chuck's treasure. Where'd it go, Franklin? You salty dog. Now look, you've sullied the air over there. That's what I smelled right before taking a dump to the head all those years ago. That is one ugly oh. chest. Oh man. It's an 
ugly chest. And I left my hook on my other body. Now how am I gonna get it open? Well, take it with us. Did I take it with us? Maybe, uh... Oh, I got an idea. The thief guy's gotta be able to pop locks and stuff, right? Surely. Surely. Welcome Surely he'll know how to pop the lock. Oh, hello. Now, let's see. I need him to get this lock open, but how am I gonna get it back afterwards? Do you think you can unlock this? Yeah, can you get this open for me? Treasure chest for me. There's a worthless slip of paper inside that I really need. Um, yeah. I'll let you keep the chest in exchange. It's a horrible looking sure, chest. Why would you want that? In fact, I already unlocked the chest while you were talking, but I'm afraid it's empty. He's lying. What? See for yourself. He's lying. What was that? Nothing. What was what? What was what? <laughs> what was you what? just kicked my spell into that pile. You did. I'm sure I don't know what you're talking about. You are we'll a horrible that. thief. Right, well, how am I going to get through that pile? I'm going to have to distract him. I can use the dog on the pile. It'll... Really? Excuse me. What is it, friend? Uh, would you mind looking behind you, you again? Mind, uh, looking behind you again? There's something behind me, you say? Hmm. Better have a look. Right. I don't know how. I don't see anything over. I don't know here. how long he'll do this for. So. Go in there. Okay, boy. Are you sure? Do your thing. Behind. Maybe if I try to squint it. I hate to be a bad host, but I'm afraid Let's you've see. got to be moving on. Oh. Okay then. Did we get back what we needed? Oh, have I messed that up? No, no. Till next time, friend. Yep. I think we did it. I think we did it. Where, where would he go, though? There he is. Did he get the Did he get the thing for me? There you are. Okay, give me the spell. Where is it? No, what have you done with the spell? Did you bury it here with all the treasure somewhere? He didn't, did he? Bad, Franklin. Uh, we'll have to use him again then. We'll have to use him again to dig it up. It's the only option. And then no doubt okay, we've got to work out what the yeah. spell is. And then we still have to save somebody. Oh, here he goes. He's digging it up. Surely I didn't need to do that. He, he, he should he should have known where he put it. Gotcha. We got the spell. For you, you little spell thief. It's the, the spell, spell that Lechuck used. used. What does it say? Back into the living world. The physical and spiritual realms I'll let him read it to you. As do night and day. To journey from one to the other, a pirate must know his way. Search around mm -hmm. you and within you to find these things. And at the center of the crossroads, present oh, them to the ring. The journey is confusing. Something must guide your way. So we need something and to guide you must us. Have an anchor. An to anchor. That you will stay. What gives you courage, courage to face the dangers to come, and a sacrifice in your name that cannot be undone? And a sacrifice. Right. Okay. Sounds bad. Still, not much we can do about it. Let's have a chat to this guy. How goes the treasure hunt? Fantastic. Oh wait. No, I don't think I need it's to speak been, to him actually. Um, Interesting, catching up, but I've got five or six impossible things to do, and I don't have time to listen to you, Kvetch. Fine. Yeah. More treasure for me. I'm not interested in his nonsense. Did I? Yeah, I didn't have that stolen. I think the anchor. Well, it said we needed an anchor, so we got an anchor. If that's is it? Is it as literal as that? Do you think? Is it a, an actual, a literal anchor that we need? I don't know. Uh, right, we probably need to ask. Maybe Morgan can do something for us. I think. Can I not just go up there? No, I need to walk all the way around. Oh, maybe I can. Just go there. Click the mast and we can go all the way up. I imagine. I guess. Dum, do, dum, do, 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 do.
Here she is. Here's old Morgan. I should be able to ask hey, her. Baby. What's up? Uh, I found a spell. I found a spell that will let me return to the land of the living. Yeah, it really? will. That's great. How do we use it? First, uh, we. A bunch of ingredients. First of all, is trouble figuring out don't know about that. To be. Maybe you can help. Maybe. What are the items? Uh, what, what are we going to ask her about? A guide. The journey is confusing. Something must guide your way. Some kind of signpost. Sounds like you need something to point you in the right direction. Yeah, that's that's maybe it. That's maybe it. An anchor. Well, I've got an anchor. I must have an anchor to ensure that I will stay. Hmm. I swear I saw something like that. Yeah, I've already got the anchor. I've already got the anchor. I kind of guessed I might need it when I saw it. To face the dangers to come. I don't know. What do you pirates use when you stupidly take on insurmountable dangers without an ounce of fear? Who knows? It's Grog. Boy. I need to learn how they do that. Rum, and a sacrifice. What requires a sacrifice made to me. Yeah. That sounds pretty Strange. complicated. Maybe you should focus on the other ingredients first. Yeah. Good idea. Yeah, possibly. Possibly. That's enough for now, I think. I'll be back in just one second, guys. Just going to do something very quickly. We'll be straight back to the game right after. Alright, let's get back to it. Let's see what we are doing. Uh, yeah, so there was nothing more we could do with her right now, so that was okay. What am I doing? Uh, yeah, back down the boom we go. Good luck with the sword fighting gig. I'll be back. Let me think here. Yeah, Grog. We get Grog, then that'll give us the courage, won't it? That's the the suggested option, I think. What do you pirates use for courage? Well, Grog, right? Grog. Or something. Ba -ba 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 -bum. What else? What else can we do? What was that? Yeah, let's get some grog. I didn't buy any before. Did I? No, I didn't, did I? I should have. But I didn't. Hope I can use this other money that I have on it. Fistful of whole eights. Grog for courage. Oh, the dog. Yeah, the dog's a guy, doesn't he? Doesn't really matter. Get some full fat grog. grog on the go. For when you need that extra something to face your day. I think. Uh, right. That's all I need for now. So I think we go. Yeah, surely the dog's the guide. You know, guide dogs and all the rest. Get me to the crossroads, please. Hey, Caleb. Hello. He's gone. Looks like he wandered off. He's gone. Maybe he'll turn up later. So what do we have here? Was there anything else here that we could do? No, I think it was just that, wasn't it? Um, right. Let's try this. Pop the grog there. Liquid courage. Check. That's the courage. And the dog. Something to find your way. Has definitely helped us find our way. Stay. 
Good so right where you are, and an anchor. Anchors away. Check. Okay. All I need is a sacrifice in my name. Where are we Where gonna find the sacrifice? Find it's gonna be Morgan, isn't it? It's gonna be Morgan. I just know it. Let's go and talk to her. See what she's doing. See what she says. I see her all the way up there. Waiting for challengers. Hmm. Maybe we can get her to sacrifice something. Hey, you. What's up? I need some kind of sacrifice. No, I still need one more thing for the crossroads stuff. I, don't, I can't some do the kind of mathematics thing. I can't find it anywhere. Yeah, I've been thinking about that. I think I have an idea. Come on, I'll show you. She's gonna show me something. What? What's? She? Yeah. Is she gonna sacrifice something herself? Okay, where is Let's this find sacrifice? Out. I I don't see anything. Right yeah. here. Oh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Is that Is that a good idea? Think about all the things she did. No, no, this is just my reputation. I can easily build that back up again. Can you? <laughs> all right. Oh. Okay. Are you sure? You have to come back first. And I'm not sure you're the one who's going to do it. Right. What's going to happen Thank to you. all those things? Well, don't just stand there. Get on with the spell. Here we go. Of course, the spell. Wait, I don't know what else I'm... What is it? What's happening? Some sort of equivalent exchange. Well, I guess this is it. Seems safe enough. I don't think Where it's Full start? Metal Alchemist, just so we're clear. Hey! Huh. That's weird. I can go through no problem. It's because she's not had anything no, sacrificed no. for her. I am not getting stuck in this afterlife. So, what are you going to do? I don't know. You just go on through and take care of your business. Could I not? I'll figure it out. Okay. Wish me luck. Ah, ah. Off he goes. Off he goes. Where are we now? What are we doing? What's happening in the world? Still gonna be a ghost though, right? I mean, that's the biggest problem. Still gonna be a ghost. The Chuck is arriving. Well, he's turned up just here as I come out. Gah! Why won't this thing open? Elaine, get over here and help me. I've What's happened to her? Months getting those mangy uh, she's not interested. Monkeys into place so I could conjure up the entrance to the crossroads. Well, that was his plan. Be thwarted now. That was what they were doing with the monkeys. Oh come on! I broke your spirit, not your back. Get over here. She thought that he was putting them back for good reasons. Kill him. And why not? Do you know the number of times that bony buccaneer has killed me? Look. I let Bloody you the me and I played along with your stupid nice guy act because I thought that it would get Guybrush to realize that the voodoo lady was, was evil. Yeah, apparently. That cursed but I mean, I was going to learn that by what? No the evil ghost pirate LeChuck. That I have La Esponja Grande. I can use it to suck pure, unlimited that sounds unlikely. Directly from the source. I will become the demon pirate god. And you the demon pirate place. god. And this time, there will be no guy brush. He's gone too far this time. To spoil our wedding plans. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? Yes, that's it. What's he done? He's thrown like a sponge of grande. I don't know if that was a good idea, or was it? What's it doing? Oh no. Oh no. He's changed? Hey, what's going on here? Guy brush? Yeah, I'm a ghost. Woo. I'll tell you what's going on here. You've lost. I've lost. I now have full access to the unlimited voodoo power of the crossroads themselves. 
This is my hmm. moment of ultimate triumph. Yeah. So, ghost of Guybrush Threefoot, would you like to RSVP for the wedding now or later? Okay. You won't get away with this, LeChuck. Get away with this, LeChuck. Never. It is you're doing. I've opened the crossroads themselves. Ever. Stop Never, ever. You opened the crossroads. <laughs> yeah. Maybe I shouldn't have. Thank you for doing my bidding for a second time. Uh, yep, we've done everything he needed us to do. Why didn't you just get the merfolk get to get the, merfolk to do it? the sponge? Merfolk. Uh, to be honest, they creep him out. Fish people creep me out. Besides, manipulating you was much more fun. That's what he does, right? He's been doing it a long time. To bring the sponge to me. So you admit that I'm better than you. I am better than you. You were the only for some things. That can do what? Uh, Come up with strange ideas. Boy, was my face red when La Esponja Grande turned out to be so small. Mm. But then you took right care of that, didn't you? I did. You're right. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have. The voodoo lady said. The voodoo lady? Yeah, way, she's been helping does me for years. Know if she has a name? It feels weird just calling her voodoo lady. I don't know. That's the name that she's had throughout the series. But I'll be taking care of her soon too. Oh no. <laughs> I have infused the cutlass of Kaflu. The cutlass of Kaflu again. That no mortal. This is the start of all of these problems. This weapon that was designed to destroy me will ultimately set me free. When oh, I know what's he doing? To slay the woman who has locked you and I in this perpetual loop of fate. Isn't that right, Elaine? Well, they want to kill the voodoo lady. Why? Yes. And we shall slay her together. What is going on? All of a sudden, what's happening bride. here? What? My demon bride. Kind of gets you all choked What's going on? She's gone mad. The Chuck has more power than any pirate could possibly dream of. And besides, you're dead now. I'm dead oh, now. So is he. I'm sorry, Guybrush. Mm. Yeah, but he's got he's got a physical body. Oh no. Oh no. No. He's drained her of her humanity. And now she's changed to a demon. An interesting demon. Mm. It's not good. The Cutlass! He's giving me the sword. Take it. Take the Cutlass of Kaflu. Yeah, that's what I thought. He can't take it. He knew this. He can't take it. That's just one of the side effects of being a fleshless spectre. Good thing you are, though. Just one slice of that reenchanted is enough to destroy anything it touches in this mortal. I think she's giving me a clue there. But I was gonna use that to save you and kill the Chuck again. Yeah. It ain't so easy being a ghost. It isn't. Now, is it, Mr. Fleetwood? It's good though, well, you can't kill me with it. That's how I felt all those years ago, when I was a simple ghost pirate roaming the seas. Uh -huh. And now, you are about to know how it felt when you ripped my spiritual essence to shreds, when you doused me with that ghost destroying oh, no. voodoo root beer. Voodoo root beer? Lady Boo? Let's not be what hasty. Do it? It felt oh, like maybe it's root grog, maybe we're okay. Maybe she'll have done the root grog thing. <laughs> no, she didn't. She didn't. She didn't do it. She doesn't do it. Guybrush, what happened? Did you defeat LeChuck? No. Avenge my death? None of the above. She's stabbed None of the above. What? Elaine, she's LeChuck's demon She's doomed me. And she zapped me with voodoo root beer. Demon bride? She must be under LeChuck's control. Get back in there and save her. No, she's not. Rescue her, yeah. She looked me right in the eyes, and then yeah, chose I mean, she's been him. overtaken by a demon now. They're gonna take over the world together. There's a demonic sword involved. It's over. Mm. Well, that's good news. 
not good news, right? you're free to just curl up and enjoy a sad, pathetic eternity in pirate afterlife. It's not gonna work. Of course, I'm not sure if they're still letting whiny schoolgirls in. You'll have to check. Mm. Come on, Morgan. I just lost my wife. And everything so else, yeah. You're back, Guybrush. Are you a mighty pirate or aren't you? Not really. I... Look, <laughs> Has I he ever been a mighty pirate? pirate to sail the seven seas. But what I've learned I always from like the that he uses that. Threepwood that inspired me for my entire life is that there isn't any situation he can't handle. And he wasn't mighty and at one all, thing you know. I've admired about you throughout our entire adventure always the together same. is that you never gave up on a lane. She's right, you know. Maybe if I could find a way to use that cutlass. But if I go back, they'll just zap my ghost again. So get your body back. What? Just get your own back. Oh, wait. Possess it? Wait. That sounds kind of familiar. Yeah, kind of like what Ooh, LeChuck did, locket. right? Find the locket, find your body. Yeah, well, and we'll see about that. Fight to that How easy is it going to be to find that? And make LeChuck rue the day he decided to mess with Guybrush Threepwood, mighty pirate. Yes. Uh -huh. I still have no clue what rue means. Hmm? But it sounded great. So she doesn't know either. What are you going to do? I'm going what is to she going to do? Skewer some more sorry ghosts. Maybe practice my pickpocketing. I don't know. She's gonna something. do something. Something Morgan. is better than nothing, right? Thanks. Oh, we're off. She's off. Well, okay. She's off. So we need to get the voodoo locket. Wait, how am I gonna use the boat if she's gone away on the boat? I need the boat. Oh, there's another one. There seems to be an endless number of boats. Now, well, let's see. Where are we going to go then? We could go... There. Oh, crabs. That's a very large number of crabs. What have you done? What have I done? Talking crabs. <laughs> Talking crabs. That's the scariest thing he's ever seen. With the barriers shattered, the chuck is now beyond all control. Because I didn't want to be dead. From the is that not okay? Realm. We're not allowed to, to want to be alive. Could unravel like a cheap rug. Apparently not. Apparently we're not. Um. Caleb told me, I, told could. me I could. Nobody said it would have catastrophic effects. Well, it wouldn't Why have if the chuck wasn't looking for it. Had nefarious plans for Las Bonjour Grande. I'm afraid the chuck made fools of us all this time. She probably didn't have an option. But hope is not yet lost. Not yet lost. Well, he didn't fool me. No. In fact, I'm already working on a plan to possess my body, so they can't zap me. But they can't kill us with the cutlass. Yes. The voodoo root beer only affects spiritual manifestations in the physical realm. If you can manage to repossess your body, you may yet be able to use Lechuck's Repossess our body. Him. I mean the, the Cutlass of Kaflu. You must figure that out for yourself. Go now. Find well, that's, your body. that's not it. Find a way for your spirit to possess it. But remember, rebinding a soul to a body is not as simple as taking yourself. Right, how do I rebind the body then? Against the natural state of things, and the how do we do it? Push back. Once you have possessed your body, you'll have to find a more permanent way to bind Permanent it to binding. Soul. I recommend Mix and Mojo brand spirit gum. It can create a powerful Mix and Mojo gum that will bring your restless spirit and body together in harmony. You get that off Stan or something. It comes in lemon. No, don't advertise the Mix and Mojo flavors. gum. I always have some. No advertising. Can you give me some of that spirit gum. I cannot risk coming out of hiding to aid you, Guy Brown. No, so she's hidden somewhere. She's hidden out. When I was in prison back on Flotsam, I may have left some back in the jail cell. She thinks she's left some in the jail cell. Spirit gum contains okay. some ingredients from the spirit realm, so it retains some ghostly properties. Be careful with it. Okay, I'll try. Now, How am I going to get it, though? It is too dangerous for me to let my true whereabouts be known. How am I going to get it? I hope this is just a phase she's going through. Let's hope so. It doesn't look like um, Morgan's not awake. What's that? Another tear in the fabric of time, space, reality. I don't know. Whoa. This old 
We're through. This thing is going to take some getting used to. Hey, you. Pipe down. We're in the middle of a pirate wake here. For me. Oh, yep, that's me. This is a pretty disappointing wake. Yeah, well, the throwing darts at me. They have hindered the turnout a bit. And why am I posed like that? It's zany. The mm -hmm. customers love it. Do they? Well, that's exactly the way I remember Thanks you. so much. Thanks so much for sticking me on a wall. Hi there. And throwing darts at me. As I live and oh, not as I do, though. Don't rub it in. Boo, I'm a scary Ooh, ghost. I'm a scary ghost. Not particularly scary, though, is he? Oh, yeah, let's do the uh, bugged out fish eyed geezer. Yeah, uh, quit that. <laughs> scary. You just screwed up my concentration. Well, it must have been a little bit scary then, right? Yikes. I better not stand Must have been a little bit scary. Down on me. Yeah, well, as long as it's not magic root beer, you should be alright. What do you want, Pipsqueak? Mm, how did you get out of the manatee? So how did you get out of the manatee and end up on Flotsam? The other manatee. Talk about it. No, no, let me guess. You took the gross out subway again. Gross out subway again, didn't you? Wrong. Now buzz off. I don't really think we need to know why he's doing anything to be honest let's take a look around what else have we got here that's the monkey hey it's jacques the monkey hey little guy is he huh. i wonder why his eyes are all funky again oh no his eyes have gone all weird can i get out can i go outside oh i can't make the doorknob turn surely you can just walk through the doorknob sure you can walk through the door can't walk through the door, it looks like. Okay, let's let's go back in here then. For now. Um let's try right, so we need to find this locket somewhere, somehow. Which I think how we're gonna do that. Uh crossroads. Is that the right place? No, I don't think it is actually. Hey, was that open before? Well, okay, whatever. Let's try here. Let's see who's around this area. If there's anybody. Caleb? What are you doing over here? He's changed the places. What's going on with the crossroads? I thought the spell would take me back, not just rip open the spiritual realm. Is there any way to stop it? Yes. I assume you are still carrying around that last. Well, I can use that. You came here with. Oh, yeah, but if you were to give that at this stage, it would be too late. The crossroad should close right up. Really? It's as simple as that. Yeah, but remember that. A simple sacrifice. You'll never go back. Shred of life, and all these rifts will seal up good as new, putting yeah. everyone in their place for eternity. Of course, you'd be stuck here for good. And the chalk is yeah. probably already powerful enough to destroy every living thing. That'll be the point. Planet, so it's too strong. It won't help so me at all. These rips, but then I'll really be stuck here? A pirate's life. Yeah. Not for me. Not ideal. For eternity. Yes. Not a great plan. All things considered. Not a great plan at all. Oh, there's another tear here. Where does this take us? Where does this take us? Anywhere? Nowhere? Somewhere? Oh, hello. Captain Threepwood? That's captain Winslow. Mr. Winslow? Captain on deck. Relax. I'm not the captain anymore. Yeah, I'm dead. I can't be the captain because uh, yes. I'm dead. I thought you looked a bit more wispy than usual, sir. And this is hardly the screaming narwhal. What happened? I'm guessing it sunk. Nasty little fellow, sir. Ooh, you were right about that one. First, he knocked me off the ship, and then he. Oh no! So he's the captain now. And then, yes. And then he yeah uh, turned into a demon. So I can hardly say it, sir. Did he make you kill someone? Force you to turn on your family? Probably not. I don't think it was that bad. He took down the map, sir. Ooh. Oh yeah, I forgot. Winslow can't get anywhere without a map. Ah, who knows? What's this stuff? What's this stuff? 
Those are the pieces That's exactly what I said. I'm inventing called rock, paper, fountain pen. Rock, paper, fountain pen? I think you should probably call it rock, paper, scissors, to be honest. Hello, little monkey. I wouldn't, sir. He's still a bit frustrated that we can't agree on the props we need for our new game. Rock, paper, and I say fountain pen. He disagrees and gets rather... He right. disagrees and bites you. Right. Um... I wonder... Mr. Winslow? Yes, sir? Does he know anything about what happened to the screaming what narwhal? After that chuck knocked me off, he simply set it and drifted sea. Okay. That's all for now, Mr. Winslow. Well, now, where was the other ship? So it must be... The screaming narwhal must be in the sea then, right? It's fine. I don't know why he's trying to hold his breath. He doesn't need to. He's dead. I think that's what's left of Dukaba's ship. It is. The voodoo lady's locket. It's stuck up there in that seaweed. But it looks like it survived another harrowing voyage through a giant... Survived planet. on a plastic bag under the sea. Where is it? Can I take this fishnet? Oh, I can't reach it. Sometimes on my birthday, Elaine wears fishnets. Uh, sure she does. This being the real world, I still can't touch anything. So this fishnet has to stay here. Yeah. Can't touch that. I guess we can't touch that, right? Because here, lock it. Yeah, that isn't gonna work. Ghost, I can't touch it. Maybe I can find a way to get it up to Winslow. Well, how can I get it up to Winslow? How can I do that yeah. if I can't touch anything? Huh. How can I? Oh. Oh, hello. That might be interesting. Hello? Swim away. Bubbles. I'll zap you with this eel. Swim away. Yeah, it's me. I need your help. I need your help out I need your help. For what? Well, unfortunately, I'm currently a ghost, so I can't touch anything. Yeah. A ghost? How? What happened? I was killed. I'll give you one guess. Killed by him? I'll stay in here, thank you, where it's safe. Well, he's not here at the bottom of the sea, is he? Uh, how am I going to get her to come out? You want to come out and talk? No. Yeah. Are you, Are you okay? okay? No, Spinner K has been destroyed. Her home's gone. What are you doing in there? What are you doing in there? What you should be doing, hiding from him. Well, it's a bit too Man, late for me, what did he to be to honest. You? Nothing yet, thank Poseidon. I know Winslow can be a bit forward, if not a bit. Is that funny, what we're but talking about? He's got a good heart. No, not sweet Reggie. I oh. mean the chunk. She oh, likes Reggie. I see. She likes he Mr. Winslow. Spinner K. The sails of his undead pirate ship are filled with the winds of the apocalypse. Oh, that's not good. Look, come out and let's talk about this. Yeah, let's talk about this. No, why why wouldn't we? It's not that scary it's not out here. It's not that scary out here. Could be skewered by Lechuk's fiery harpoon at any second. He doesn't have a. It's not that bad. What? Can I get you to Can come I out somehow? Come out? No, I don't trust anyone. Well, maybe Reggie. Wait, okay. Winslow? That salty dog. Despite our taxonomic differences, Winslow. It looks understands. like we have to get Winslow to come and speak to us then, right? Well, that works. Um, somehow. I don't know how I'm going to do that. I'll never see him again. I'll be back later. Be careful. We need to get Winslow to come down somehow. I don't know how we're going to do that. But maybe he's got some other way of helping us. I don't think he can dive. If I remember rightly, I don't think he's a particularly good diver, is he? So, but maybe he'll talk to me. Mr. Winslow? Yes, sir. Uh... Anemone could use a sign of affection. Down to Something to show you Anemone. Affection? A capital idea. Perhaps a poem. Oh, a haiku. It's written a haiku for her. While working on the sashimi islands. Whatever, as long as it sinks. Don't you worry. While waiting for the currents to cooperate, I've been working on a game I've entitled Rock, Paper, Pen. Mm. How's it played? Well, 
paper beats rock. And then the players yeah, I understand shame the idea. The paper into defeat by filling it full shame of the paper into the defeat. Using the pen. Well, nothing like it's a an interesting shame. idea. Anyway, I have it's a different way of doing it. I need to write my dear anemone a haiku. Good. Do it. So that I can live. Maybe. Stone lift quivering spirits. Yay. That's what we want. It's all for now, Winslow. All for now, Mr. Winslow. Very good, sir. Jump back in the water. Now then. Now then. Oh, hey, I think... Oh, where's the... There it is, but I can't pick it up. Obviously, I need to... I need anemone to do it. I need anemone to do it. If she can. Are you still in there, and then enemy? As long it's closer. As She's getting alive, closer to her I'll name. Be in here. Thank you. Uh, Winslow dropped a note down to you. Anemone. Winslow dropped a note down to you. It's sitting right over there. Yeah. Anemone. Now she'll swim out. Oh hello. Hello. That's what we want. It's a love note. <laughs> I'll be back later. Be careful. Great. That's great. It's a love note. Fantastic. Do this. Is it Clam, I think we got off on the wrong foot. <laughs> Food. Oh, I'm sorry I made light of you not having two feet. It's not very nice, is it? We did it! Holy clam bubbles! Locket saved! We got the locket. Well, we got the locket out of the water. I say! Well, we got the locket on there. Sent me a sign. I must prepare no, no, that's 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 room. mine. It just came up. Mizzens. I haven't <laughs> smelled this rotten since languishing in my own filth while doing my time in the hold of Captain Liverbottom's traitor ship. Sounds like fun. Not really. What's that? Deodorant. Captain. Old brute. From the apothecary in Old Wood, Tick, brute. Winslow, the locket isn't a sign from Anemone. She loves it's your not poem, you. Want. I sent that locket up here. I can't touch it, but it's the thing that's going to reunite my ghost with my body. Potentially. Ooh, most important, then. Most. Yeah, very. I'll hang it here as if it were our map. Remember our mm. map, sir? How could I forget? Remember the map. This locket lead you back to your body. The way our map has led us to adventure. Potentially, yeah. I think. If I put another photograph of the locket. Cover up the voodoo lady. Voila. And then get him to Mr. press Winslow? the button, right? Yes, sir. Mind pushing the button on the Mr. locket Winslow, for me? Would you mind pushing the button on that locket for your old captain? Certainly, sir. Certainly. Hmm. I'm alive. Ooh. I don't remember my body being this cold. You're a zombie now. Hey. Jump it's alive. alive. It ain't alive. It's some kind of voodoo zombie. Quick, oh. chop its head off. What? Don't, don't, Ooh, don't chop my head off. Don't worry, Your Honor. A good womp in the choppers ought to take care of this one. I'm Guybrush Street. <laughs> I mean to kill you, all. kill you all. I kill you all. Oh, damn it. Right, sir. No, not really. I think I just had the spirit knocked out of me. Ah, uh, yes, that would explain the girlish scream. The girlish scream. Hold on a sec. Mr. Winslow? Yes, sir? Could you press the button again for me? Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. Send me back. Back for another round, zombie boy. No, hold on, hold on. I surrender. You do? Terrific! Off to jail with ya! Put me in jail? I'll be back is that, is that the... Is that the right jail. option? Sure. The ladies come calling, I'll tell them that's where you went. Hmm. Oh. Great. I'm in jail. Again. Hey, that brick behind us looks pretty... I wait, hey, she had that gum somebody there. Somebody stashed something behind this loose brick. What is it? It's a diary. Oh. A diary. Dear diary. Well, from Bug Eye. Apparently, I misunderstood when the mer person I met asked if I needed a lift. I assumed that meant I could <laughs> ride all the way into town. 
Anyway, I'm hiding you for now in case they search me. Yeah. I don't want anyone knowing my personal inner thoughts. Hmm. What else is in here? Dear diary, I think that man will now start the man will start kissing. I hope I can slip out just as he slips the. Oh tongue. my god. Ew. Oh my word. I, read enough. I think that's that's obviously how he did whatever he how he escaped. Is that some kind of poster in there? Can't quite, can't quite make quite it out. It I need to be in the other cell. I need to be in that cell. cell is covered with chewed gum. What else is there? A mug? That cell gets a mug. I'm thirsty too. There's a mug. Um, what else? I don't think there's anything else I can get here. Any you know stalactite of gum. A big wad of gum stuck up there. Hmm. How else? What else can I do? Mug poster. Is that some kind of poster in there? I can't quite see it from here. We're stuck. Uh oh. My uh -oh. body is starting to feel all numb and tingly. I wonder if that's a bad sign. That's probably a bad sign, yeah. Probably a very bad sign. Uh oh. I mean, there's nothing we could do there right at that moment, hey, was there? What happened? I don't know, sir. There really wasn't. The locket sparked a couple of times before I could say sexy fish. What? Back here. Sexy fish? Why would you say that? Sir. Something I picked up while on my tour of the exotic, the exotic limbo, limbo islands. Island. So what you're saying is the effects of the locket are temporary. It that looks like it. Appear to be the case, sir. Well, we knew that already. Just great. We knew that already. Now let's go back in here. And then I think we have to go Let's go talk to them in the club again. I think. I think. Oh, we can upset. We can. Where was that? That was here. We can upset Bug Eye. By telling everyone that he. Yeah, how he escaped from the manatee. He won't be happy. Let's do it. Let's ask him how he got out of the manatee this time. He didn't seem very, uh... How about he get back here? We came to check on you and found it just laying around. We figured you were dead again, so we just put you back here. Fair enough, thanks a lot. Where's old Bug Eye? Let's embarrass him a bit. Yo, Bug Eye! What do you want, Pipsqueak? Um, how did you get out of the manatee again? Seriously, how did you get out of the manatee and end up on Flotsam? <laughs> I said, I don't want to talk about it. I bet I can guess. Mm. You slipped out on the tongue. Perhaps you waited <laughs> around until the mating ritual, made your way to the tongue, and escaped when the manatee went in I for the kiss. I think he did. Hey, who told you that? That's private information. Well, nobody did. What, what do you mean? from the manatee, you... Rode a merperson to Flotsam. You a merperson who you ended up riding all the way to the shores of Flotsam. That's I knew that impossible. picking that up would. No one knows about that. No one knows about that. Look at me, I'm Bug Eye. I like to get in on manatee makeout sessions <laughs> and ride merfolk around. He does. Are you mocking me, boy? Yeah, I'm mocking you. What's he doing here? Oh, we got to do a face. Have we? we got to pull a face. Um, that one. Yeah, that looks right. There. Arr. Does it look like I'm mocking you? Does it look like I'm mocking you? Yeah, yeah, it does. It totally does. I'm Big Bad Bug Eye. I keep a girly diary. I wish I had hair so I could put it up in curls. Bam. Let's just see how that face looks with my fist shoved in it. You've forgotten that I'm a ghost, right? All right, that's mm. enough. I think, I think someone else is going to prison to now. Down, lad. It's off to the drunk tank for you. Ah, now hang hey, on. You, don't slime up the place while I'm gone. If he goes in one of the cells... Then I'll go in the other one, right? No. That's just weird. I'll just leave him there until he cools off. Good plan. Leave him there until I've fixed my body situation. That's what I say. Okay. 
Okay, I need to go back to Winslow now. Go back to Winslow, try and get in the cell. I don't know how long I'll have to survive, but... Hopefully we can do everything. Uh, gateway. Back to the gateway. I think. Uh, yeah, go through the gateway. Winslow's round is in this one, so if I go to him, get him to press the button on the locket, and then I think we can get where we're going. Come on, come on, hurry up. There we go. Right, Winslow, I need you to do that again. Yes, sir. Press the button again for me. Would you mind pressing the button again? Certainly, sir. Hopefully we can get the chewing gum and stuff. Maybe. I mean, I don't know, but... Yeah, get rid of all this stuff. I'm back! Hold your ground or I'll take you down what? yourself! Ghosts are one thing, but I really hate zombies! He doesn't like zombies. Well, I surrender. I just want you to put me in jail again. Do. Terrific! Off to jail with you! Right. Let's see what we need to take now. The guy. We're neighbors. Oh. Shut your cheese hole, zombie boy. You're the reason I'm in here, you know. Well, all right, all right. you say that. I think your poor impulse control is the reason you're in here. Free Guybrush Streetwood. Free Just don't. Guybrush what are you doing? No new taxes. Down with now porcelain. With porcelain. Hey, lay off the bang and <laughs> shove that bug up your blowhole. Free Guybrush Streetwood. Free Guybrush Streetwood. Oh, this just isn't the same. That isn't the same. Uh oh. I feel a depossession coming on. Oh, I don't have time to do anything. Can I get any of this gum? Okay. I can't believe I'm actually about to do this. Will we get the right one? That's the question. Ugh. Disgusting. It tastes, tastes like, like earwax. Earwax. That, maybe nope, it was. That didn't do anything. Guess that wasn't the spirit gum. How am I going to find the right one? Is it that? This stalactite of gum looks pretty fresh. Is it that one? Ooh. Hmm. Dust, spit. Uh -oh. and just I don't think that's the one we want either. Otherwise, it's completely tasteless. So what else do we want? What about this poster? Can we look at the poster now? Uh -oh. Ah, I didn't have enough time. I don't think we need to look at the poster. It's just something we could look at again. You know, every time I pass out in the jail, they haul my body back to the bar and redecorate it. You think I should go back as a ghost and check on my body? Probably. Hmm. Yeah. Who knows what strange party favors they'll dress my body up in next? I hate to think. Thanks for the advice, Mr. Winslow. Certainly, sir. I hate to think what they're going to do with it. Especially now that I've come back and forth as a zombie more than once, right? Well, let's find out. I don't think there's much left of this, so I think we'll we'll play this right to the end. Because uh, I don't think it'll take very long. Yeah, no, nothing's really happening. Uh, where was it? The sword fighting place. And then through the tear. It takes a while to walk to it. But that's where we need to go, so let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hi everyone, I'm back. He doesn't care. Trying to concentrate here. By throwing darts at me. Stop throwing darts at me. Hey, how'd my body get back here? He obviously moved it. it figured he was dead around. again. Said he that before, didn't he? Again, so we just put you back here. Good. Who posed me like this? I look like a, a pirate, pirate panhandler. panhandler. Let's see if we can scare him. Hey, Hold on a tick. I've almost got my stroke back. Have you? No, oh, that's good. Well, I'm going to scare you. Ooh, Hope you like this. There he goes. Uh, bugged out cross. No, bugged out tweaking mini monkey. Yeah, that one works. Yeah, uh, quit that. You're I've got a scary. hole in the you just root beer. Concentration. Good. Can I look at it? A mug full of root beer. 
Now all I need is some ice cream oh. and my corpse to be able to enjoy a cool refreshing root beer, beer float. float. Um, Has I anyone mean, ever made one of them? I don't know. Is that something you can have? Somebody filling this mug with grog. <laughs> okay. Right. Let's see what we can do. Oh, I know what I can do. The root beer will help me work out which... The root beer will help me work, work out which chewing gum is the one that she wants us to find. I think. I believe. That's kind of what she suggested, wasn't it? Okay, uh, right. So, to do that, so hopefully this time we shouldn't, uh, we shouldn't end up out of our body, I believe. I hope. I think we're right this time. I think that should, that should sort it. Should sort it out. Let's find out. Okay, wind's low. Fire me back in my body again. Would you mind pressing Please. Certainly, sir. But then I'm going to be a zombie. I mean, I don't know if I want to be a zombie. Do I want to be a zombie anymore? There we go. Put a root beer in the pocket. Surrender again. Ghosts are one thing, but I really hate zombies. Yeah, you said that before. I surrender. Do. I surrender. To Off to prison we go, and this time, take the root beer, pop it on the chewing Let's gum. See how spirit gum reacts to a little root beer. Ooh. Should become noticeable at that point, I think. We should find the right one. Oh. Hey, now. This is delicious. Like he's found it. And tingly. And hey, keep it down over there. Keep it down. Whoa. Why? Now that is spirit gum. He's done it. He got his spirit back in his body. Now what can we do? Pin up pirate. I wonder if this is like an Andy Dufresne thing. Hey, look at that! A gaping round hole in the wall. The voodoo lady must have escaped through it's this. It's an escape route. Convenient. Okay. So what am I? All right, corpsey body. I'm Let's a go get zombie now, Kaplu, but I'm also able to get out. Down the chuck once and for all. Hey, I'm also able to get out. Come on, at least Good. give me some gum. Give me some gum. Why? What do you want gum for? Here we are. We're back, LeChuck. facing the chuck. Well, yeah, anything but I want. so get ready to be touched to death. Touched to death. Sharp, pointy death. Get the sword. Ouch! How beat you that stings! Yeah, how does that happen? Do you think I'm some kind of dolt? It's a trick. It's a trick. Dolt? This sword it's a trick. Has demonic power in it to bring down a god. Did you? Mm. Think I need my hook. You get your mortal hands on it. I need my hook. Seriously, who uses the word dolt anymore? With just one swipe, that sword could completely obliterate your body. Yeah. I do wish you hadn't made such a pest of yourself. I wanted you alive to see me marry Elaine. Wanted me alive? Why did he kill me then? Lechuck, I'm already married to death. Do you part, Freepwood? And that part has already been taken care uh, of. It's not wrong. Elaine, my dear, please dispose of this irritating corpse. With pleasure. Oh no. Oh no. Is she really gonna kill him? Is she really gonna kill him? I'm in trouble now. Elaine, sweetie, stop! It's me! She's in trouble, no, no, she lost the sword. Winslow's here. Oh, sir, I found the map! Mr. Winslow! Oh, there we go, we got some friends. I have a wedding ceremony to plan, a dress to pick out, a reception to arrange, and some bridesmaids to slaughter. We got some friends. I don't have time for this. Go for it, do it. Kill them all. 
I don't think we can kill them all. We're getting a battle sequence. A battle sequence. I'm more powerful now than I could have ever been as a lowly governor or a pitiful pirate. Stupid mm -hmm. sponge. I liked you better when you were smaller. I think that's what we need to sort out. Shrink the sponge. I've shrink the sponge, shrink solve the problem. Sponge. It'll reduce the power, right? This is marvelous. You really think you still have a chance? Well, ahead. give it your best shot. I'll even give you a head start. What are you going to do? This. Oh no, please tell me this isn't like in, monkey, in the second Monkey Island where he's going to be chasing me around the place. I really don't want that. That's really annoying. Listen up, oh. Sponge. It's time you lost some weight. I still have my Feast of the Senses spell in my body. I just need to find someone who can help me reverse it. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Where can we go? Um, let's talk to Galeb at the gateway. He seems to know quite a lot. Seems to know quite a lot. Only this time I have a body as well. I'm actually a physical body in the afterlife. So I can... I don't know what I can do. I've got a physical body, but, you know, what use is it to me? I wonder, actually. Let me just check something. Oh, I've got additional items in my... In my pocket. Hi, Caleb. Oh, hello again. Hmm... What am I going to ask him to do? Help Can me help reverse, reverse the spell. spell? You said you were a connoisseur of the occult, right? Feast Maybe. of the senses. Try to watch your figure, eh, Porky? What? No. No, it's not no, for no. me, obviously. It's for... Don't the sponge. Wood. Oh, come on. That doesn't even sound like no, Bigfoot. Not even close. Losing weight is easy if you follow a strict no, diet. It's not the... Here, try this. No, I don't need a diet. I... Never mind. Hmm... Was it? Diet, Diet of the senses. senses. Like a sponge, you are bloated in your hips and thighs. Ah. Block out the sight with a cover for This'll your work, eyes. right? The smallest mouth snacks on a tiny whispered word. A sound so petite it is barely heard. A light touch for an, an appetizer, appetizer. Stay true, stay true thrive. and thrive. A delicate feather sixth sense, plucked from a smell. bird half alive. This is all the your stuff that we did before. With fates not yet dealt. You'll find that a secret will help tighten your belt. Ow. Sorry, Fight just a moment. the smell of the after-dinner treat. Eliminate odor and the urge to eat. This must to be what we want. Weight, you need food with no flavor. Find a taste so bland there's nothing we to say. Bland about. taste. All sorts of stuff we need. Sounds like it's going to take longer. Which is a bit awkward. But never mind. Uh, let me think. Where do we want to go? We want to go... Here. Which will then take us back to the place. Although I don't know if they're going to try and put me in jail again. We're good. Right, let's go. Good so far. This is going to be like that sequence, isn't it? I've got a horrible feeling this is going to be like that sequence. I'll have that blindfold, thanks. How come there's only one of these? I thought all probationary members had to wear blind No, well, how many people are there here that aren't there? There are no probationary members here. No. But your bouncer said, oh, that rock rib. Oh, It was a joke all along. A, laugh. It was a joke all along. Shouldn't have been much of a surprise, should it? Right, let's get back into this tear in the fabric of space and time. I think... Right, we're good. Uh, where else could we get stuff? Maybe... Oh, the manatee place. We can get some stuff in the manatee place, I'm sure. Where do I have to go to get there? The gateway. Yeah, and then down. A lot of back and forward for this last part of the game, which yeah, is uh, it is frustrating. However, if I remember rightly, there was a there were some things down there we needed. Let's see. Okay. Winslow's not here anymore, but I am. Let's take that his deodorant. Old brute, 
the pirate alternative to bathing. The pirate alternative to bathing. Stave off that fresh corpse smell I'm starting to notice. Probably, yeah. Uh, it's not a bad idea. There was also a net down here in the ocean, I think, that we needed. Which was... It was the only other thing I saw here. And Dukava's helmet's there. I don't think I want that, though. Um, a fishnet woven of the finest meshes. That's what I want. Give it to me. And then I think we want to go straight back out. Up we go. Back to the uh, to the afterlife again. I believe. I don't want to play rock paper fountain pen. Not right now. Whoa. Okay. What else? What else? What else? What else? I'll tell you what, those parrots that come out in that treasure place, they must be for something, right? I mean, they don't just appear there randomly. There has to be a reason for it. Let's find out. Let's find out. Mm, let me think. Great. More tiny parrots. Yeah, more tiny parrots. I so then we As you say, a lot of these guys. I think we can catch them though if we're careful. In the fishnet maybe. I'm not close enough. Do you know what it is? The problem is here. But that gets in the way of what I'm trying It's impossible, I can't do it. Unless I dig that one. Don't go too far. See, he's gonna go there. Yeah, send me some, send some more, but... Okay, I guess this is the only treasure I'm gonna get. The problem is... First whispery parrot. That I can't... I can't do anything. Because, because that pops up in the side. Imagine putting that sidebar there. Oh, there. I didn't take the bloody thing out. Can you believe that? I didn't take the... I wasn't using the net. I need to catch them with the fish net. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's you, Guybrush Threepwood, Mighty okay. Pirate. Put them over there. Right. Just make sure that I've got it visible. I mean, that's just that's just annoying, right? I need it to be on the pyrite parrots, but can I not put that somewhere else? If I could move that to the left-hand side of the screen, it would solve all my problems. That that's annoying. It's right on the... I can't get any closer without scaring them away. <laughs> and I've not even got it. Look, sign go away. If I go any closer, they're going to disappear again. Oh, 
Honestly, why? Why do the inventory like that? That's just so stupid. Can I just do it on the sign? I have to catch I them. Three feet of those parrots. If only I had four foot arms. Four foot arms? Hmm. I don't have four foot arms though. Nor do I have any way to make four foot arms. I'm pretty sure I need to catch these. I've got absolutely no way of doing it. Check something. I don't want that. No. There's nothing I can use that'll fix anything there. Yeah, great. Okay, Send them off. This is the only treasure I'm gonna get. Stupid I've got to click on the parrots on the top of the sign, but the way that the game puts the sign. can't do anything. You know, so it's like, even though... Even though I'm using a controller right now, I can't do anything with it. But then I also can't... I wanted to finish this game, but do you know something? Now I'm getting... Oh, hello! I just had to walk to the right place. Catch the parrots! Got them. We got the parrots. Okay, that should work. They're like tiny, annoying golden mosquitoes. That should work. I hope. Let's stick them in a jar to make sure we. Don't lose them. Sorry, guys. I need to keep you in a more. All jarred up. Okay. Um. Where do I want to go now? Let's go through here and see where this takes me. What's this? Dead Three seagull. Lord. Oh, she's here again. Spirit binding must be messing with my She's head. here again. Do we trust her? Hello, Guybrush. Huh. You can do that too. I'm sorry, but I must still conceal She still can't tell you where she is. communicate through the vessels of nature's works. You picked a dead seagull? A perfect place to go unnoticed. No one look at one. Can't help but think the advantages No of one would look at one. Useful. Yeah, probably. Your ways of voodoo have really done a number on They have. Lately. They haven't the helped me much at all. Of the tides of our suffering cannot be controlled. Why are you doing this to me? What did I do to chap your hide? I am not your enemy. You're not my enemy. In fact, I have most likely saved. Right. I'm starting to wonder about that, to be honest. Mess of a body here. What the heck am I anyway? A zombie. I feel one step removed from a zombie. You are no stranger to the reanimation <laughs> of corpses. Should be obvious. You are now familiar with a form that the Chuck has known so well. So you're zombie pirate the Chuck. Defining such states is folly in the realm of voodoo. I'm a zombie. If you insist. <clears throat> you don't have to keep saying you are. Uh, is there any way that I can... Anything I should know about being a zombie? Anything else I should know about being a zombie? Are you flush with zombie advice? Your Probably not. Is not lost. All right, I can get it back. Now we're getting somewhere. But such I can get back to real life. Is outside of the realm of voodoo. It requires something much more rare. Oh, God. Uh, a four-headed monkey? Four-headed monkey? <laughs> that I'm afraid I don't know either. Right. The spirit must be compelled to So she, that itself. power is beyond that her is abilities. I can share. It's beyond her abilities. Okay, well. Right. I can't keep wasting time. Lane isn't getting any less demonic. The sponge guy brush. Yeah, we return it to its small size, I know. It. Yeah. Well, that's about all the difference. Yeah. As you wish. I get lost. Yuck. Come out of that seagull. There's a feather there, though. A I feather. might take. 
A tiny touch. Might be useful, a tiny touch, yeah. Gross. Exactly. There's also another hypnotized monkey here. These are the monkeys that LeChuck laid around all over the place. Another hypnotized monkey. There's a chest here, I'm going to assume it's locked. And just use the same thing we've used to unlock chests before. Because they're always locked, right? They're always locked. Looks like somebody was on their way to a LeChuck dress-up contest. Oh! Treepwood. Oh, she's live. She's back again. Doing that. She's scary. Treepwood! You'll find some of the things that allowed LeChuck to get so close to your beloved Elaine. Oh, will I? What? I don't think yeah, don't look in. Don't look. LeChuck's human form was most impressive. But we can all use the well, I thought the Chuck was going to be chasing us around time. these these portals, but the so part. far, at least, that's it's not happening. Trust, you see, the Chuck's belt should do nicely. Don't you find it strange that the Chuck left this? Yeah, why is this here? I think he'd want to get rid of it. The Chuck oh, is maybe. careless. Yeah, I would. I would say he. I would say he's careless. The bird is not helping me trust her more. <laughs> I would say he's careless. He usually is, isn't he? What's that? belt buckle or something. So yeah, I mean, if we have his belt, I suppose that's helpful. But I was wrong. Lechuk isn't chasing us around. Or at least not yet. I mean, I don't know. Hmm. Hey, but I just... The thief guy was friendly with Lechuk, right? I wonder... If we can get anywhere with him. Where did I get out of here? Let's try the thieves' place. There must be a portal there too, I would imagine. Let's find out. Maybe this will take me somewhere Welcome useful. Back, yeah, thanks. I've got a corporeal body now. You don't. Ha ha. Um, let's try giving him this. He likes trinkets take like that, doesn't this. he? Nice find, friend. Did you steal that? Just yeah, steal? absolutely. Well, I did I have did. to pick the I lock. Snatched it right off LeChuck's belt. Hmm. I trust that you did. <laughs> yeah. What if I told you that I stole this from a three-headed mermaid who had come here from the future riding a giant space turtle? I trust you. <laughs> if you there must be some sort of magic on this, then, right? There must be some sort of magic on it. Nice secret you've got there. Care to share it with me? Hmm. Normally, I wouldn't trust. Normally, you wouldn't trust me. Yourself. But there is just something about you. I think it's safe to say oh, that that, that's uh... that's just the enchanted voodoo charm talking. What? <laughs> yeah. <I'm> nothing. <laughs> that belt is, uh... That pirate thief stole my voodoo trust charm. He got the belt, Buckle. Good. Well, okay. <laughs> he can have it, I don't need it anymore. Alright, uh, we got... Let me think. The deodorant for the smell... Taste. I gotta go. Come back soon, friend. The bland taste. We need to deal with that one. Um, the only place we can get any kind of food is probably the. Oh wait, that that gum that was hanging from the. From the jail cell. That gum. Was tasteless, wasn't it? It said it was totally tasteless. Well, he's going to send me back to prison again. As soon as he sees me, isn't he? As soon as he sees me. Hey, WP. Hold on a tick. I've almost got my stroke back. I surrender. Take me to jail. Take me to jail. For what? For being a being a zombie. My own body. Good enough. Let's go. Kidnapping my own body. Okay, uh, let's have some of that. Tastes so bland, there is nothing to say. Yeah, that should do it. This ABC gum should fit the bill. It should. And now we can go out of here. Hmm. I guess I'll head back to the bar. Yeah, back to the bar we go. And then get straight through the tear and... How Wait, come out. It comes out from the toilet. Back in well, my that's, regular digs. that's well, not nice. For wear, considering. That's not very nice. Alright, we need to... I think we need to pop back through here. Yeah. 
We've been doing alright. We're doing okay. Alright, uh, let's think. I need to go back to the crossroads now then. I think we're ready. I think we've got everything we need for the spell. Yeah, we've got everything we need for the spell. Okay, back to the crossroads. The sponge is sticking through here at the crossroads, as you'll see. And we have to put all of these items on the sponge. So, what did we have again? We had the, the bland chewing gum. To keep off the weight, you need food with no flavor. Find a taste so bland there's nothing to savor. Uh, Here you go, sponge. A taste that's oh, not that's worth savoring. That's one. Then we had the blindfold. Like a sponge, you are bloated in your hips bloated and hips thighs. thighs. Block out the sight. Out the sight with a cover for your eyes. Cover your eyes. Yeah, pretty much. Trick. That would do the trick. Check it out. Uh, we need the little touch. That was the seagull's feather. A light touch for an light touch. Sorry. Stay true and thrive. Light a touch. Plucked from a bird half alive. Bang! There we go. Uh, what was it? Deodorant. Deodorant. For the smell. the smell of the active yeah. iron tree. Eliminate odor and the urge to eat. Fights odor and wetness for the active iron. And sponges. Yeah, should do the job nicely. It's even got some hair on it too. Lovely. Uh, this secret box, because they said something about a secret, your right? Sense is bloated with fates not yet dealt. A secret will help You'll tighten your belt. A secret will help tighten your and it belt. tied in with the belt secret? buckle as well. And the only other thing should be the jar of parrots that I had. The smallest mouth snacks on a tiny yeah, whisper. Small mouths. A sound so petite it is barely heard. Bon voyage, my barely audible buddies. Uh -oh. Barely audible buddies. Here we go. So that should be reducing this the um That should be reducing his power if I remember rightly. What? Don't you think what you did yes. be undone? Elaine will be we've got we've got her back. Come high water. She's better now. Hi, Brush. Help. The voodoo lady. She brought me back. Yeah. The voodoo lady? Yeah. Think of all the peril that woman has put Yeah, and in. think of all the times that we've saved the world because so of what long, she's done. Brush. I mean, without her, attack. You know. Backwards sea slug. What's that all about? Oh, he's blotting out the sun. The trident. But he's just frozen everyone in place. This be going on far too long. What is? Elaine is mine. My demon Wrong. To make me a king if I come back to life, then to see to it that it's fine, right? Fortress of evil is kept tidy in case we have oh wait, so all you're wanting is for her to, to tidy you, clean and tidy your house. Socks. And How about that? That's my lady How about a sword through well, the right, chest? Katie. He doesn't give you much to work with, does he? <laughs> uh oh. <clears throat> Excuse us a moment, Guybrush. The wifey and I need to have a little private talk. Yeah, she's not your. Wow. She's not his wife. Come back through the. A futile, if admirably treacherous uh -oh. gesture, my buttercup. Even without La Esponja's. Yeah, he's already got I've more already more power than anyone. So much power than that anyone. I can step into the crossroads and take as much voodoo energy as I desire. Great. <laughs> you see. You can temporarily destroy my body, Elaine, but you cannot damage my spirit. <laughs> okay. Oh, my spirit. There you go. That, you Spiritual sword too. Oh, Morgan. Well, she's back. Well, what are you doing here? To and harm. Did you get that sword? Lechuk. Look, we can kill Lechuk, but we have to find a way to take him on in both the physical yeah. and the spiritual Great. planes at okay. the same time. Do what now? <laughs> Take him down. Yeah. 
Not a great start. And now he's going to throw me back through here again. I'll be back for you, lass. Uh oh. He's doing it. Well, it's bad. Let's shock. Uh oh. What's he doing now? Where's he going to put me now? Think of all the times you tried to destroy me. Ah. Uh. Ouch. All that pain, Ouch. All that suffering. Now just imagine what I'm gonna do to you, sorry, board. I'm scared. Arr! Uppercut straight into the old uh Guy brush. Not good. Oh, I can slide down that uh thing probably. Slide down this rope. <laughs> Try to fly away, little peepwood. Oh, I didn't get very far. What's going on? Maybe we need to slide down the uh, mainsail. Mainsail. Uses than that. Oh, fuck. And another sail filled with the ill winds of change. Let's jump down it. What are you doing? You know what's so great no? about Okay. <laughs> Both getting our cardio in for the day? The simplicity. Did we? It's just you, me, my ship. No We've gone the wrong way, I think, have we? Boots, I hate that woman. He's very not. He's very angry. Oh, he put me on the deck. So that's fine. Uh, Elaine. You need to fight the shark. We can stop the chuck, but we have to do it when he's crossing yeah. between worlds. I'll try to lure him across. You stab him with the cutlass. I'll fight tooth and nail for you guys. Yay, she's gonna fight him. Is she though? Uh, how, what do I? Can't move around anymore. Does Elaine okay. know about Morgan? What, that she's, uh, that she's what? helping me? That sultry seeming That she's helping me, you mean? Corsair sailed for only him. A pity I had to kill her, but now they can kindle their love in hell. That's just not true. Why am I back up here? Like this. Why am I back up here? I've always wanted to try this. He's gonna slide down the sail. Didn't work. Oh. Didn't work. Oh wait. Elaine! Guy brush! Attack the chuck, not them. Attack the chuck! I'm on it, sweetie. Yeah, come on. Are you, do are you doing it? You're not doing it. Ladykins! Creepy! Didn't say I'm gonna lure him in again. I'm gonna try to lure no problem. I'm supposed to be attacking him. What are you doing? <laughs> what are you Would doing? You mind inspecting me hull for me? Oh, what's he doing now? He's putting it's me. Holes. We should really take. He's putting me under the sea. Mug of grog. Talk about the good old days. I think today will become my good old days. Will they? Will it? What's around me? What's going on? Stop it, you monstrous maggot! Too late. He's put me under the water. Not even you and your flimsy sword can stop me now. Watch me try. I mean, I thought that sword was good for destroying him. Keys. Keys. Got them. I don't know what the keys are for, but we got some keys. We got some keys. Hmm. How do I get back on board? I'm getting, getting dragged round the entire boat. Ah, oh, that's what a keel haul. He hauls you round the entire keel. I guess. Guess what that's supposed to mean. You look spent, Swabby. Perhaps you ought to rest a spell. Ah, yeah. Why not? Okay, straight through there. 
Does this help me? Is there somewhere I can go here? No, he's straight back out. Come on, Guybrush, you can do it. Is there anything around that I can use? Nothing I can use the keys on that I can see. Oh, here he comes. What's he doing? It's so cute watching my dear Elaine swing that sword like she knows what oh, she's what's doing. Oh, he doing now? Did it ever occur to you that I know more about that cursed cutlass than all of the barnacles? He thinks he knows more than us. Oh, straight up here. Straight up here. There must be something I can use those keys on, right? Right, get straight back down. Get straight back. I can't do it that way. I have to do it this way. Don't know how to get down to the main deck from here though. Can't use the sail. I have to. I've got no way of getting down now. Oh, here he comes. Maybe he'll help me. Maybe he'll help me. Let's see. Anything around? There must be something that these keys are for, and I haven't seen anything yet. Maybe if I grab them. Is there anything around that needs a key that needs... Uh, I like mine better. How do I... There's nothing I can do in that area. I need to get back to the deck somehow. How do I get back to the deck? Oh, he's come for me. But Maybe he'll knock me down better. I, you've kidnapped Elaine. You've strung me up in lame traps. Zapped me with a voodoo Whatever. doll. You've tried to force which is Never tried to kill me so mistake. brazenly. Mind the draw. Oh, just dropped me straight off the side. Oh, maybe this will help. Oh, it looks like there's a door there underneath where Elaine is. Oh yeah, that, that's what I want. Keys. Unlock this. Is that drug barrels? Drug barrels! Well, hopefully that'll help me. I can't do anything though. I'm, I'm kind of just stuck. Uh, considering their buoyancy, bones are not an altogether bad choice for ship. Not a great. <laughs> yeah, not a bad thing, I suppose. I suppose. Um. <laughs> And keel hauled again. I don't think there's much I can do about it. I'm being keel hauled again. Right round, see? Right round. Here we go. What am I doing? Uh oh. I have got something. Like that. Can I do something with this? Flip onto that barrel if you can. Oh ho! Ho ho ho! I can see something happening now, Luke. I can see something happening now. It's so cute watching my dear Elaine swing that sword like she knows what she's doing. Did it ever occur to you that I know more about that cursed cutlass than all of you barnacle brains? <laughs> oh, he just knocked me in the sky again. Uh, okay. What can we do here? I think I need to slide down that rope again now, surely. I guess. There's not really much else I can do. There's the tear in. the crossroads, at least the chuck won't have as much sea hardened ship to smash me into. Yeah, there's a cannon there. It's a giant demonic that would work. of doom. That would, be just that would work, I think. For me to hide in. Maybe. Can we do it? I can't. Maybe I can get launched into it by somebody. Well, we'll soon find out. I'm not going to give up and just go away. It's not going to happen. Oh, hang on. What if I get... Interesting. Light the cannon for me. Light the cannon. And now I should be able to... 
I stand on this broken seesaw, seesaw door... See. Huh. And then, oh, there we go. Straight in the cannon. And we've lit the cannon, so... Bam, off we go. I'm through! The Chuck's giving me a bit of the business. Yeah, we're having some trouble with him. We need to trap him, Guybrush! No. I know exactly how to trap him. Cozy together. When I'm done giving three points, I think painful and permanent farewell into the afterlife. I think I know what to do. We're gonna have to trap him. Stick my my shred of life. Guybrush, what are you doing? It's only way. Yeah. What? He's trapped. Yeah. Yes. Mm. They've taken his spirit and his body. Here we go. The morning sun. Wait. But Guybrush is now trapped forever. Is it over? In the afterlife. Hello. Did we win? I don't know. Maybe. I guess we did. Hmm. Yep. Looks like we did, Guybrush. Looks like we did. Courage, anchor, direction, yeah. sacrifice. Place these things in a ring, a ring. at the center of the crossroads. At the center of the crossroads. Clever. Ah, Wow, what a rush! I'm back! Hey, my hand is back! Oh. Back for good, oh, maybe. I'm back for a while, anyway. It is? Until the next time he's, uh... Me? But I was dead. ...brought into action. Why you gave me? You should know enough to trust me by now. Yeah, that's what the ring was for. But you asked the Chuck to make you a demon bride. How did you know I would be able to bring you back from that? Because she knew that he wouldn't stop trying. All of our adventures, two things are certain. He wouldn't stop but trying. I always have a plan. And that Guybrush Threepwood will always come for me when I need him most. Always true, right? Yeah, why not? He'll always be the shiver in my timbers. Well, Straight back. The important thing now is that LeChuck is gone. For good this time. Do you think so? And you are finally free. Do you really think he's gone for good? For you I mean, there hasn't been a Monkey Island game since this, and but that's what but do you really think he's gone for good? What Grande thing has been about, huh? Actually, it's pronounced Esponja with an H sound. La Esponja. But we Grande. Haven't said esponja. Everybody yes, has. It's been bothering me this whole time. <laughs> it's been bothering me the whole time. I'm just telling you because I don't want you to look silly. Oh, Didn't want him to look silly. Well, he's always looking silly, right? I believe there's a there is a scene at the end of these credits uh, that you can watch. I don't think you can skip to it. I think that you have to you have to wait through the credits to do that. I think we probably already know what kind of thing might be at the end. It's gonna be what. Something about LeChuck, right? Surely. Well, I can resume there if I want to. I think there is an end credit cut sequence, cut scene sequence, but you know. But there we go. I've reached the end of uh, the Tales of Monkey Island. Uh, you can find the other parts of that that I didn't do on stream because I only started doing it on stream after I came over here to Twitch. Uh, you can find them on my YouTube channel, uh, which is just super notice if you're interested. Uh, and there's a lot of other videos there too. Uh, also, if you have been enjoying, please, please feel free to hit that follow button and uh, see if we can, if we can't start growing our, uh, growing our community here too. That's what we want. That's what we've needed all along. I believe. For now, thank you very much for watching. And we must be pretty close to the end of this. So, why not let it run? 
Although, you know, the problem with credits, the biggest problem with credit sequences in games these days, you know, they take forever. I know that everybody wants to, everyone wants you to know, you know, everybody wants you to know who was involved and all the rest of it, but sometimes it'd be nice, you know, if you had some briefer ones that maybe let you still watch the or even just if there's a if there's a post credits uh you know if there's a post credits sequence make it so that it doesn't stop you know it doesn't disappear if you decide to escape from the credits there should be a way to skip the credits if you just want to see the end scene is what i'm trying to say <laughs> that's what i'm trying to say May not be a popular opinion, but it is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Create with the telltale tool. That sounds a bit. Da -da 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 -da. Oh, now we got to look at localization and all that other stuff. Have a vote. Who do we think we should even bother? Should we even bother? I'll be back in just a moment. The credits will probably still be running. Just a sec. So, my child, just in time. Have you done as I asked? Good timing. I have. Now for your end of the deal. Wait. Yes, your actions have What's influenced on? your fate. I will allow your ghostly form to return to the physical realm. It's the voodoo lady. On as a fearsome pirate hunter. Ghost pirate hunter Morgan LaFleur. Ghost pirate hunter. I'm going to enjoy this. How are you going to You're not going to be able to do anything. You have chosen your own fate. Now go. There is much work to be done before the tides of destiny shift again. I think... <laughs> is she evil, do we think? Is she evil, or is she neither good nor evil? I've really never been able to work it out. Anyway, uh, thanks very much for... Well, for tuning in, if you have. I hope I'll see you again next time. For now, though... Sam and Max 2010... Awesome. Anyway, see you next time. Goodbye for now.